PC because it's default again. Oh, goody. So happy that it's default again. Thank you, Amaki. Greatly appreciate it. Uh, actually, uh, yeah. Nope. Yep. Nope. OBS updated. Broke the sound. Yay. I'm getting there. Give me a second. And you see, that goes there, and that goes there, and that goes there, and that goes there. And thank you for letting me know. I'm just getting started, so it's not that big of a deal, thankfully. I haven't done anything. Uh, <laughs> I was just talking about the Echo 19 audio mod uh, that I put up, which I just posted the link for. Um, and DCS Worlds. Now, really, I mean, <laughs> broken things. Yes. <laughs> It's kind of like this. We were going to play Elite Dangerous today. I wanted to go see what was going on in the hip system because it's burning. But unfortunately, when I try to connect up to Elite Dangerous, I just keep getting an error back and I'm not getting into the server for some reason. Could be a firewall issue. Could be Comcast put up my firewalls again. I'm not sure what the problem is uh, in that particular situation. Hopefully it's nothing. Uh, but uh, we'll find out. But uh, anyways, the sound pack uh, that I was talking about, Echo 19 audio for DCS Worlds is an amazing audio pack. It basically redoes all the sounds that are in DCS for the core product of the game. So missile fire, explosions, rotor sounds, engine sounds on a lot of the different planes. They also make it for the F-14, the F-16, and the F-18. And these mods, you can donate money to them if you wish, but they always state that zero is a valid price for their mods um and of course if the mods live up to the youtube then i am going to end up donating i'm going to throw a hundred dollars their way or something uh through paypal because i mean why wouldn't i i mean it just looks phenomenal uh in that situation and sounds phenomenal in that situation on the youtube so i'm hoping it actually you know we actually hear and see some of the differences here also, I only see a black screen. I don't know if you're still in OBS. Uh, no, OBS is fine. Uh, the black screen is just because I switched over and I was talking about the mod. So no, we're good there. I haven't fired DCS up because I had to shut it off in order to install the sound packs, which I just did. And uh, we're getting ready to play, so. But unfortunately, I've been sitting here talking to myself for three minutes. Going blah, 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 blah on an intro that is now not going to be there. Again, thank you, OBS, for the update. You suck. <laughs> no, actually, OBS doesn't suck. O OBS is pretty cool. I like OBS. Why is my chat hiding behind that? It's actually... Hang on, let me adjust that. Apparently, it reworked some of my screens, too. Let me get my chat and raise it up a bit. Oop. That way it's not blocked anymore. How odd is that? Man, there we go. That's the only problem about running this stuff. Every weekend, I got to check all my settings to make sure everything is good. Because somebody's updated something somewhere and something isn't working. Um. Oh, well, not a big deal. Uh, yeah, I know. I'm, I, I'm just going to put on, I'm just going to make a big warning sign. That says warning technical issues. <laughs> all the time it's just nothing but technical issues what's broke well my camera's broke okay now my sound's derp now my game won't flip oh my god always and forever with the technical issues yeah what's it been three years and nothing but technical issues at least it's good for comic relief all right so what we're doing is a series of foothold anybody can actually join us uh which is perfectly fine i kind of recommend uh you know it is a cooperative map. It's not PvP. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, you know, a lot of people... Add Ted technology happening here. <laughs> technology happening here. Warning! <laughs> Broken. <laughs> right? Add a tag that says, warning, technical difficulties. Always technical difficulties. But no. PvE map, cooperative. You guys are brand new to DCS. This is probably a... It's not the greatest way to get started, but if you know at least some of your playing, you can get on there and have fun. Uh, I enjoy playing with people. SRS Radio is up and running as well, so we do have in-game comms, uh, which I also just updated, so we're going to turn and get that fired up next. I'm firing that up right now. There we go. It says I have no mic output. Oh, there's a shocker. I'm sorry, but you don't have any mic output. Oh, it's so good. Hmm. 
I, I'm going to have to say I do. But, uh, hmm, yes. Turn that off, put that there. All right. Auxiliary output speaker. Uh, you know what? I, can I use that? I don't have that set to anything. Yeah, that works. Okay. Audio preview. Hmm. Let's see if this actually behaves itself. All right. <clears throat> as soon as I get the SRS up, I'll get into the game. So let's see what happens here. There we go. All right. I like SRS radio. It adds a whole new dynamic to the game. You actually have to use your radio in the game, which is cool. Uh, yeah, I absolutely dig it. Please use default mic. Uh, no, I, I do not wish to use default mic. Thank you. Uh, digital audio interface. Why, yes. Preview. Hey, look at that. It works. Imagine that. Cool. All right, it's up and running. Okay, so let's get that connected. Connect. Uh, problem initiate. There's a different out. Very different output. Client is. Please post your client log to the Discord. Mm. Technical issues. Oh God! They just turned around and dropped. It's like, nope, not gonna do it. Which makes no sense because the audio program just worked. <laughs> okay. Badoop. I only needed it once, thanks. All right, so we need a different output. Um, hmm, good question. Let's see. Uh, well, I want you guys to hear the radio too, so how the hell is that going to work? That one. That one sounds good. Hang on, give me two seconds. I want to make sure this is going to go through. Answer no, it's just going to crash. I think it hates me. I do believe it dislikes me right now. Here we go. Let's do that. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, okay, connect. Initializing problem with mic, try different. Uh. Welcome to the technical ding-ding stream. <laughs> Breaking things? When am I not? When am I not? Seriously, when am I not? I, I don't. I don't know what you're talking about, Amaki. I wish I had a camera so you could see my face. I don't know what you're talking about. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Um. Hmm. Maybe. Should not be set. Okay. Ooh. Bit of feedback. How are you getting more feedback? Really? Uh, okay. But uh, can I do this? Probably not. Let's do that. That, that. Wow. That mm, one. An optional mic output. Optional? No mic output. No pass through. How about now? Ah! There we go. Problem is fixed. Sort of. Jeez. There's a lot of feedback on that. Okay. Why is it doubling back? Because it is. Because it wants to. Because it's mean. Mean like that. It's amazing how sensitive these mics can be. Let's turn that down. How about now? 
We're kind of quiet. How about there? There we go. Got it. Okay. Looks good. Looks good. Looks good. No problem. No problem. No problem. Looks good. Looks good. Connect. There it goes. Connect. 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 Nice. All right. Now I'm just going to figure out my hotkeys. I already set this once. Okay. That should be queuing. Should be queuing. Problem is, I can't tell if it's actually queuing the mic or not until I get in the game and somebody joins me. So it'll either work or it won't. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Well, it's like with my family. When they want to see what's wrong with a vehicle, they let me drive it and all the fun stuff will happen. <laughs> right, exactly. What's wrong with this? Hang on. Piston flies out of the hood. Bing! Oh, there's your problem. <laughs> All right, let's get in the game. Now that that's running. Uh, right okay. And then the next thing that'll break will probably be my chat. You'd be like, no, no, you can't have a chat here. I'm sorry, no chats allowed. That'll probably be the next next thing, possibly. Hey, at least the VR is working. So that's a plus. Now, the last thing, if I could just get my camera working again, then you all could see me with my virtual headset on. It would be great. Uh, I would love to get the camera working, but it has been just, I don't, I don't know. I tried rewiring my computer the other day and still had no luck on getting that camera. Work. I think the camera's just dead. Honestly, I think it's just toast. All right, let's see if the chat loads. Well, it says there's somebody there. Uh -oh. Mm, excuse me, hiccups. I apologize. All right, so that's looking good. All right, all my settings look good. Okay, we're going to do a test. Make sure the chat is behaving itself. So I can read chat. Test and booyah. All right. That's actually working without a hitch. Usually I got to restart it three or four times. It's crazy. All right. So we're going to do this on a replay here. And I can change that out at any point in time. Okay. Cool. Let's get going. I've been looking forward to this all day. I'm just sitting back and playing a game, you know. Honeydew lists. My wife is really big about the honeydew lists. Where did my room? Oh, well, a dog obviously laid here. My rudder, my uh, rudder pedals have uh, run away. Hmm. Come here. Come back. Nope, nope, nope. Yep, right there. I'm going to be messing with that for a minute. <clears throat> hmm. Caught a wire. Put you in your slot. All right, that looks good. Everything looks good. Sweet. All right. Have you tried the camera on another computer? I have not, but I'm going to. I'm going to give it a go, see what happens. All right? Yeah, I sent a... <laughs> Death is coming for me. Well, there's a shocker. Yeah, no, I haven't tried the, uh, I haven't tried the dan- the, the, blah, 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 blah. See, there we go. English, how do? Wow. I haven't tried the camera on a different computer yet. Um, I need to, for troubleshooting purposes. I do know that. I just haven't had any time for anything. Um, my anxiety meds just, like, wipe me out. Or my anxiety wipes me out. And then all I want to do is sleep. Like I did today, you know, I posted up, Hey, we're going to get started as soon as I'm done taking a nap. That was at 2 o'clock. I set my alarm for an hour. I woke up at 6. Help my wife get ready for work and then started setting up stream it was like well here we are i honestly want to get two cameras working i want one camera 
to actually show my desk setup and then another one for my face is what I want to do because I want you guys to see this 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 I mean the Orion actually in use is amazing because even in VR it's like I know where everything is at and it's great because I can go okay click this move that do this I have it's come down to muscle memory uh, which is wonderful All right, that looks good. All right, since we're starting off on the forest, I'm going to go ahead and take an F14. And we're going to basically start this out with a combination of... I'm probably going to do bomb and uh, air to air. So as long as I can get <coughs> Jester to do his thing, we should be all right. Yeah, I did. I did. I pretty much just got started right after the nap. So I imagine there's going to be uh, things like, you know, coffee involved and things of that nature. So, yeah. Let's see. We only got the Forestal to jump off from. Or the Invincible. I ain't using the HMS Invincible. I have the Harrier. I can't fly the Harrier. I really need somebody to, like, teach me all these planes. Self-taught on the 14. I just got semi-lucky. I can fly it fairly decently. Uh, I get dogfight against AI decently enough. So, decently enough. Two to one, KD. I wouldn't exactly call that, you know, excellent flying. Hopefully, I can up that today. Your leg waiting. Maybe come on, you can do it. Just thinking hard. And apparently, my uh, MFDs went on and offline again. I hate it when they do that. Chuck Bug, what's going on? Good evening, everybody. Hey, how's it going, man? All right, frame rate to stable, and go. Oh, looks good. Nice. All right, let's get this old thing powered up, huh? I'm just gonna use the auto start here. Chief, disconnect ground air supply. But no, man, we're doing good, man. Uh, getting Copy. the Syria foothold map ground running. Air supply is now Chief, connected. Off the ground and power. of course, since open beta and uh, Copy. stable on the same version, anybody can connect up. So if you guys do want to connect up to the server, go ahead and log into the Discord. The community server stuff's right there. We are using SRS Radio, which I just confirmed is up and running. Uh, so Roger. Good there. And, uh, yeah, no problems, man. I had a few technical issues, but nothing serious. That was more vicious. All right, let's always start. Got technical bugs. There, let's get me uh, adjusted to my seat here. Oop, that's too far. The only bad part about VR is finding a comfortable spot. Good part about DCS, as long as you don't turn off the game, that comfy spot stays right where you want it. I have to say, they got the tracking down pretty good. The Siri map is gorgeous, though. And the Forestal Free Carrier? I like it. I do like it. I kind of wish we had the crew running around on the free carriers like we do with, uh, you know, the super carriers, but, you know, that's okay. Forrest still is more of like 1970s and 1980s style aircraft carrier, non-super, of course. Chief, disconnect ground air supply. Turn off the ground power. Alright, we can go set to 4,000. We're going to leave it that way. 
There should be more than enough gas to get me home, considering I'm just doing, you know, some air cap here. Let's get our weapons set while they're doing their thing. Weapon rearm and refuel. All right, we're going to change these out for bombs. I'm thinking... Uh, what are we thinking? Merc 82s? I'm thinking 82s. Yeah. Yeah, we'll go Mark 82s. Pretty simple stuff. I shouldn't be able to screw that up. <laughs> shouldn't be able to screw that up. We shall see. I wonder where I got the VF91 skins from. Can't remember. Yeah, I'll go jollies. Request refueling. We'll go with 103. Request rearming. RWR says we got two MiG 25s. That way. So they're already coming after the carrier. That's good. 25s? Yeah, 25s. Yeah, there's three of them. Hmm. That's weird because MiG 25s don't have uh, radar. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, 29s, 25s. All the fun toys are out today. It's what? Five on one? <laughs> functioning properly. Adjusted to my seat here. Ready to taxi. Awesome, awesome. Hmm. Let me set my gun counter here real quick. Hang on. Six ninety up. Hmm. Okay. Uh, Wings are already set. Just gonna lock it down. Let's cover. Click out of DCS worlds because that's the thing. All right, here we go. Cover closed. Reset button hit. All right. As we're steering on. Let's get lined up. Yeah, it's a little bit different doing it here because we don't have the uh, ground crew to say, hey, you know, you need to be XYZ this far out, so on, so on, so on. So we're kind of doing it by feel. Which, I can do that, thankfully. All right, kneel down. I know I'm off center, but it's good enough. Thankfully, magic happens, usually. There we go, connected. Yeah, so don't be intimidated by the cat too much if you're ever playing on an aircraft carrier. The cats have a big, um, what am I trying to say? A big, uh, Degree of error. There you go. So, I mean, getting lined up, as long as you're within these blocks right here and making sure that you're kneeling, you know, do your kneel and then hit you, you'll hook right up. Now, the supercarrier, 
it a little easier because the guys are like, wave, go left, go right, you know, that sort of thing. But here you don't need to worry about that. You just kind of like roll upon it, make sure you kneel, connect. Once you see the steam coming out of the cat and you feel a little rollback, you know you're good to go. So we're going to get out of here. All right, go to full military. Because she's a beta. Oh, Afterburn at the last minute. Probably going to black out as soon as it hits the launch. Wow, I did. That's amazing. All right, we are up. Laps up. Gear up. Um, nails, uh, 7 o'clock, and, uh, nails, 4 o'clock, and dirt, 3 o'clock, okay? Go. A bunch of stuff that way. Yay! Yeah, let's get our data links running. Alright, man. All right, we're on guard. Roger. Oops. All right. We're going to fence this baby in. Copy. Okay, here we go. That was weird. Master arm was already set. Oopsie. Oh, we got nails right on our six. Goody, goody. That does That's, sound very uh, good. Nails, uh, 2 o'clock, and dirt, 11 o'clock. That's actually pretty cool. Mm, one, radar, 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 radar. Oops, wrong one. Mm -hmm. Brain, how do? Hello? There you go. I got something out there. I've got some dirt at 9 o'clock. You got dirt? He's got dirt. I got 229s out there. They're going to be fun to fight with bombs. Maybe I should have cleared the skies first. Bandit, 065, 55 miles. I got a lock. Target, 54 miles. There he is. Okay, looks good. Target, 50 miles. Not exactly sure how well this is going to work, but we'll see. Forty-seven miles. 
looks like he might be over the mountain. I bet he's over the mountain. Uh, I got some dirt at 9 o'clock. Yes, sir. Woke up. Yes, sir. Target, 44 miles. In case we run anything, just snap to air to ground. No, he's coming for us now. 7,000 feet above us. Let's get up. Target, 41 miles. I really don't know how well this is going to work. F-14 versus MiG-29. Oh, hey man, you're at 10 o'clock. He's trying to reel us. He's not getting any closer, which means he's turning tail. Target, 38 miles. I got ships out there, too. Damn. Okay. This could get dicey. Still coming at us. Hey, I got some dirt at 11 o'clock. Target, 34 miles. Not yet. Save the gas. Uh, I got some dirt at 9 o'clock. Now I see. Those are our guys. Okay. Our guys. Cool. Looks like we got a cruiser group, destroyer group down there. Target, 31 miles. Yeah, looks like a destroyer group. Okay. I thought maybe it was it. Hey man, dirt at 10 o'clock. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm working on it. Come on, keep coming. He's really trying to get me into that Sam area. Target, 28 miles. Here we go. Minimum range. Or maximum range. Getting there anyway. There's no way I'll hit him with a shot like that. Looks though. like nails, 1 o'clock. Oh, now he's noticed me. Come on, Q, get bigger. Get bigger, get bigger, get bigger. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Target, 25 miles. That's it, that's it. I've got some dirt on the nose. You know what, me too. I mean, wait, what? That's pretty good. All right, Fox One. Yep, Full that's good. At Eleven o'clock. Look at that thing go! Target man. twenty-two miles. Boom! Sparrows are fast. I mean, they just roll. Like a bunch of eights and a bunch of twos, and I'm a sitting duck. All right, we've got mud right in front of us, 12 o'clock. All right, here we go. Come on, missile, do your thing. I think it's already missed the target, unfortunately.
That's a MiG-25. Target, 19 miles. Did he say MiG-25? Oh, yeah, I guess it would be, wouldn't it? All right. Well, in that case... I've got some dirt at 3 o'clock. Slow the MiG-29, we're getting down. MiG-25 is a maneuver like garbage. We have a singer on the nose. And dirt, 7 o'clock. So we do. Yay. I lost lock. Searching, searching, searching. Somebody really doesn't like me. <laughs> Imagine that. There they are. Oh yeah, I see ya. You bastards. Now where'd that 25 go? That's what I want to know. Oh, I'm showing nails 11 o'clock. Nobody likes you? <laughs> That's kind of the way I'm feeling right now. Fights on! Sam launch! 12 o'clock! Hot! Break left! Break it left! We have a singer! 7 o'clock! I don't see it. Yes, I know I'm dying, I get it. Missile, 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 freak out, freak out. There it is. Hold on, we're gonna lift the nose and flip around it. Sam, 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 12 o'clock. Hot. Yeah. There you are. Sam, 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 11 o'clock. Hot. Yeah. Yep, we took it. Shit. Owie. Why do you keep unplugging and replugging back in? Well, that didn't go as well as I'd like. All the beeps and boops! Right? Still alive, though. Hmm. I'm gonna need some seed stuff. Might be able to get into an SU-25. I could do seed on an SU-25. But well, my concern is those MiG-25s up there. Er, SU-25. Blah, 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 blah. You know what I'm saying. All right, so... Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Can we do that? No, neutral. Shoot. Unit type. I actually lasted a lot longer than I thought I would, which is good. All right, negative, negative, negative on any of that stuff. Well, maybe. All right, here we go. Cool. We can do some seed. We're gonna need it. Gotta get rid of that air defense. Good lord, man. That was just no fun. <laughs> well, actually, it was a lot of fun. Things like this. The reason I like this game. Right on. Now the question is, did it remember my settings? Weird. Thought I heard something else. Okay. All right, electrical? Mm, apparently not. 
Yes, Gilly. I'd like to turn the electrical on now. Thought this is the switch I had you bound to. Apparently not. Working on it. Go. Perhaps, maybe. I don't know which button it is. Where my electrical panel go? Seriously. I put it around here somewhere. Ah, uh, time to check the controls again. But this time, if they debound, I can just put it back in. All right, electrical. Oh, look at that. It did debind him again. Well, okay, not completely. Electrical power switch. Hmm. It did partially do it, didn't it? Well, that's interesting. Okay. Good to know. Hmm. You know what? I think I'm just to make this easy on myself. Yeah. So now I already got the engine set up. So we're going to put it on the MFD since this is a basic plane here. Just drop it there. Yeah. That works, right? All right, so I'll need electrical and then engine start, I'm pretty sure. Start left, start right is all tied into the throttle. Okay, good. Let's see. Start, stop, start, stop. All right, looks good. One of the things I like about these planes here uh, for the flaming cliff planes is they all pretty much work the exact same way uh, when it comes down to anything like that go electrical up is I need to break this here it's actually super easy to get them started it really is just turn your electrical on start your engines and that's it there's really nothing else to it so all right let's arm up for uh seed Oh, yeah, and close your canopy because, you know, you don't want that open while you're flying around. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. You know, because flying around, yeah. What do we got here? Elant pod, huh? Looks like this thing is just kind of set to, yeah. Hmm. All right, let's clear it. Flares chaff looks good. Infrared in case somebody wants to play. Hmm, give me a second here. I like the idea of having the pod. Don't need it, but I like it. Oops. I wanted that. Yep. Okay. <clears throat> Air to ground missile. Semi active passive. Updated. Arm IN. Updated? Question mark? Did I miss something? Hmm. Maybe. Hmm, I think that is it, actually. This is not the missile you were looking for. What? Wait a minute. I will not ever guarantee that this will work. Because it probably won't. Um, but you know, hey, we could try. Hmm. 
Hmm. Unguided rockets. Yeah, why not? What's my weight look like, actually? What is my weight? Oh, we got plenty of weight. Actually, I'll take a couple of... And I'll take a couple of those guys. So... That should work. Can never remember which one's the which one's basically the harm variant here. I think that's it. Passive radar. I think it's the passive radar. Shoot. See, this is why I always have backseat gaming on in case anybody's got the answer and goes, "Use that one." I'm like, "Okay, yeah, I'll use that one." You know, because I can never remember. I, I think that's it. If not, we can at least use it as such. Definitely not Argentina. Okay, we'll go with this. Request rearming. Copy. I think it's just always armed to the teeth. You know what I mean? It's like, whoo. It's basically. Just nasty. It's nasty. Rearming complete. Okay. Make sure the parking brake's on. I don't guess actually doesn't have a parking brake, does it? Nope. <laughs> ah, oopsie. All right, gear down, laps down. Yep, don't need those. Okay. Looks good. Engine one coming up. She's spooling. Everything looks good. Spooling up engine number two. Glad she's back together. Or not. Actually, no, I'll keep them separate just in case. Engine two temp looks good. RPMs look good. Still coming to life though, I have to wait a sec. Getting ahead of myself. Yeah, like starting the A10A is just like this. Turn the electric on, poop poop. Agency, flip this switch, push that button, make this here, go there, go go there. Okay, button, beep, 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 boop, boop, boop. I love the A10C, but the startup procedure is like hee. <laughs> you know, I try to do like Ralphie Dudes tutorial zero to hero, which if you got the A10C, I recommend. It is pretty awesome. Um, really spells it out for you what you need to do in order to get things started, how to use it, whatnot. And, and learning. And learning. But I'm also autistic, so that makes it a little harder sometimes to learn. Sometimes you sit there and go, 
I don't get it. And then you look at it again and go, almost oh, well, son of a bitch. <laughs> you know. And it's like, wait a minute, I do get it. All right, engine two looks good. Let's see if we can get ourselves out of here. Um, right on. Engines are locked into place. I think everything's working. Like it should be. I don't know why the uh, MFDs keep turning off and turning on. I've been doing that for a while. Pod looks good. Uh, it's beefy. Okay. Switch weapons. Let's check that. What's the range on these guys? I don't know. Oh yeah, I put it there, didn't I? Oh, okay. No, I did not. Give me just a second here, trying to figure out where I put what. Okay, no. Yeah, that's Chaff and Flare. Okay. Where did I put my change weapon button? You tell I don't fly this too often. I was pretty sure it was this one or this one. There it is. Up. Okay. Yeah, I thought so. Fire weapon. Alright. Jettison weapon. Right. Countermeasures. Here we go. Yes, yes, ECM and IR. So where did I put the IR jammer? Because that's going to be really important. Oh, it should be there. What did I do with you? Oh, down there. Gotcha. Okay. That works. Kind of an odd place to put it. But it works. Okay, we're ready to roll. Let's do it. Ah, death. Here I come. Perhaps.
Yeah, but don't let anybody fool you about the FC3 planes. They're just not completely modeled, so everything has to be bound to a switch. You know, simple, simpler controls, I think is actually what I'm trying to say. Slightly simpler controls. You know? As far as the way they're modeled, fly, and carry on, perform, I guess, they do pretty good. Friendly five to the right. Dodge two one. Unable to clear for takeoff. Whatever. Dodge two one. You are cleared for takeoff already. Climb three zero zero at USE seven five five decimal seven eight. Let's make sure I'm going in the right direction, shall we? Oops. All right, Mousy, give me on me. All right, zoom in. Runway 25. Should be heading towards runway five. Wow, that is long. I probably could have taken off from right there. Probably still could, actually. Well, let's hope, because I'm going to try. This is... Never do this. This is me being stupid. Oh, yeah, I'm going to run out of runway way too quick. She's trying. Come on, beastie. Up we go. Wow, she did it. I am shocked. Crazy little plane. And we're up, man. Cool. Now the cool part about this plane, I know it's going to sound a little weird, but no radar, which means uh, no signature. So if we stay low, we should be doing all right. Obviously, we don't want to stay too low. Like, you know, treetop level's good, but we don't want to kiss the trees. Like that. Kissing that power line would be bad, too. We've done that enough. You know what I mean? Watch out for that tree! Exactly. Okay. Let's scoot.
We have beepies. Beep, beep, beep. There we go. God damn those MFTs. What is the deal? I'm gonna have to rewire them. I'm gonna have to unplug them and just leave them unplugged, I'm afraid. Definitely search radars out there. Oh, yeah. That's why I like this camera, too. It's like, what's out there? Well. Let's find out. Ooh, they shut themselves off. Ah, oh, you bastards. I had you for a second. Well, we know they're this way. God, is there a nuclear power plant around here? I've never seen so many wires in one little area. Jeez. Hey, high voltage lines. Hey, high voltage. Oh, no, that's just not funny. Mm. Uh, go under him. Okay. Mm. Good lord. Must be a city out this way or something. See, I'm sight looking. Something's looking. Could be an airplane, too. I uh, can't remember. Can I turn my lights on? Well, that's not what I wanted. Thank you! Mm. So I just turn everything off. Oh, God! No, TV, come back to me. There we go. Do not press that button. Maybe. Hard to say. Guess we'll jump this mountain and find out, huh? Okay, now I'm getting two hits. Right, exactly, Chug. Oh, God, squirrel! Somebody should clip that. <laughs> squirrel, I thought you were right! Squirrel, right there. Ah, oh, gosh darn it. I don't think we could have timed that any better. That was that was that was beautiful. Squirrel, boom, right? Oh yeah, I know I'm dead. <laughs> oh, that was fantastic. Okay, let's try that again.
I mean, seriously, squirrel. Wow. Way to go! Hey, by the way, oops, he broke it again. Oh, yeah, big shock, right? Uh, yeah, I'm gonna fight him with me. Yeah. I should mark that. <laughs> <laughs> that was beautiful. Ah, uh, all right, flip that. Flip copied, sure, okay. Thanks, I think. I don't know how far that clip goes back, but probably not far enough. Oh, whatever. I'll get that clip to put it on the Discord. That was that was great. Okay. All right. Note to self: Don't do that. All right. God, when don't I break it, Amaki? Oops, he crashed it again. His hair is on fire. Oh, God. You know. I don't feel like it's actually changing weapons. All right, button 22. Okay, should be that one or that one. That one? That one. Okay, it's not those. It's that one. Up. Oh. Yes. Why is this a problem? Mm. Oh, well. Okay. That's fine. Whatever. Ground crew. Need to rearm, please. What do we got? Actually, we're already carrying the Cougar 12 updates. Okay. Archers. What are these? Button toys. Ooh. All right, works for me. Not gonna hear me complain. 128, 128, standard. I don't need to do anything. Request Jump in the plane and go. We don't even need to rearm. We're just ready. Sweet. All right. Feedback from the stick. Now, the one thing I am gonna do though is I'm gonna. Until I figure out what is going on with my MFD stuff, I'm, I'm unplugging them. There is something happening with them. And I don't know why they keep turning themselves on and off. There, which makes me sad because I use them in Elite too. They're really, really fun, but I can't have them popping off and popping on and stalling my game. That's just not gonna happen. I'm not, I'm not dealing with that because it's also interfering with the VR frame rates. Oh god, that is so much better. There we go. Well, that sorted that out real quick. I wonder if they're bitching on the same channel and I need to like move them around again. Hmm. That's valid. I guess we'll find out, right? Alright, unhook the throttle. <clears throat> Alright, left and right are separate. Start engine one. There, she's spinning up. I don't know, I just think that's crazy. It's like, wow, really? Hopefully I didn't kill anything when I unplug those. And thank you for that clip of Maki. Oh God, squirrel! <laughs> right? Eh, well, you know, it's valid. Wow. I don't know if you guys noticed it on your end, but the frame rates went way up. Houston, I think we have a serious problem with the, uh, yeah. It's unfortunate. I wonder if that's been my problem. Something wrong with the Cougar MFDs. I guess it could be. 
strategy two. You know, I don't think that's going to work. <laughs> Just saying might be a problem, could be an issue. Yeah. So, got it. <laughs> huh. Let's try that again. Okay. Oh, that's why that switch is... Okay. Only bad part about owning a, H a HOTUS like this, if you don't recheck your switches to make sure they're okay, bad things happen like, oh, I don't know, landing gears just decide to trigger in and it goes up. That was awesome. As soon as I had electrical power, it's like, oh, you wanted the gears up! Boom, boom. Yep. There we go. Electrical up. Okay, let that tune itself up. Go, engine went up. At least we already know what armament we're carrying. We're good to go there. Yeah, if I had a bitch about the Orion, I'd say that'd be the only thing is, okay, you're restarting your plane, right? You're on the deck. And all of a sudden the switch goes, oh, the landing your switch, because there's a toggle switch for it, goes, oh, you're in the up, I'm in the up position. Hey game, I'm in the up position. And all of a sudden, <laughs> other than that, it's it's an amazing hotus. I love it. I like it a lot. I'm sure everything's working here. I disconnected those MFDs. Unless they're having a small issue. Okay, that looks good. That looks good. Start the second engine. I love that click, man. Going from stop to idle, just go. Oh, so good. And this thing works great in Elite, also. It is mm, tasty. And I, I, I've had a lot of, I've had a lot of hotuses. Um. My first one was an X-55, you know, like, spending a lot of money on, like, joystick and throttle, hands on throttle and stick, you know. My first one was an, X an X-55, and everybody bitched they were having problems with them. I actually ran mine for 3,000 hours of Elite Dangerous. Uh, I can't remember how many hours of Star Citizen before the wiring loom broke. Um, so it lasted me, like, four or five years, and I was, I was abusive. When it came down to wrecking that throttle back and forth, man, there was nothing nice about it. It was, you know, but it, it did it. It worked. It did well. Um, and that's when they first came out. All right. Second engine looks good. Yep. She's responding. First engine's responding. There we go. And uh, no, don't you dare. We're not shutting it off. There we go. And it actually did very well. I was very happy with it. Go, ready switch. Get that going. That looks good. Okay. Let's test things. All right, that's up. That looks good. All right. Sorry, I'm just running through my checks real quick. Make sure all my buttons are decent the way I want them, which they are. Very cool. Okay. Paddle check. Paddle's good. That's good. All right. Let's roll her.
But yeah, I haven't had a dual throttle uh, until I got the Wing Win Orion 1. And you guys all know how much I was raving about that. Because I was... The X-55 died, and then a buddy of mine named Rickbo donated money to the stream uh, to get me an M1600, or 16,000, Thrustmaster. And the throttle was super good. Still have it, actually. My son uses it. Um, and it was really good. The stick was the only problem that kept running out. Like, the twist kept breaking. Like, first year, just outside the warranty, the twist on the stick broke. Which was kind of a bummer. And I was like, oh, okay, well, you know, it's been a year. I was looking at replacements, and at the time, it was like $65. I was like, oh, jeez, a $65 stick breaking after a year? You know, that's... That's nothing. The throttle still worked great. Um, and I was like, you know what? We're good. There's no, there's no issue with that. That's fine. And then... Um, so I got another stick, and then the, it broke again. And I was like, man, okay. So I've spent $120 in two years. Hmm. Let's think about this. I can, I can pay another 65 get another one. Because the throttle was still good. Or I could get something else. So what did I ended up what I ended up getting was a VKB Gladiator. Which I just shipped off to Grimmy, by the way. He's going to get that. It's still a perfect working order because it's, uh, the Gladiator's less than two years old. And I'm talking and not driving. This is why people with ADD and autism aren't real fighter pilots. Oopsie. You know what? We'll go. We'll just go around. That's fine. There'll be another turn off. Anywho. <clears throat> so I got the VKB Gladiator next. That thing was like night and day. Even to my X-55, it was like night and day. Beautiful stick. Still gorgeous. I love it. Um, and I bought some parts from Etsy for the throttle because third year using that throttle, it finally started to wear out. It started to break down, and I'm like, huh, okay. You know, it wasn't the wiring, though. It was like sticking. It would slide. Uh, I was having a whole bunch of problems. But this guy made these, like, new bearings for it in 3D printed parts. And it was, like, 10 bucks. So, throttle was already out of warranty. I said, what the hell? Bought it, ceramic, put some uh, lubricant on there. From what I read on the forums. You know, something that wouldn't eat plastic. Let me tell you, smooth as butter. Oh, it's so good. It worked so well. That guy is still making parts on Etsy, by the way. Anybody want to get your hands on them? And, um... Just gorgeous, man. I'm very well done. And then, um... Let's see. I started getting more into DCS. Because at the time, I had the F-14. And... I had the F-18, and that was it, as far as modules. I, I didn't have anything else. And all this stuff started coming out, you know? And I was looking, I started to look at, like, older modules. And uh, I got wrapped up in... Uh, who was it? I can't... I want to say it was Drewski first that I found on YouTube with DCS Worlds. I think it was Drewski. And I was like, oh, okay, this is cool. I started watching it more and more, and I'm like, you know, this is really kind of cool. Because as far as, like, instant action, you know, I did instant action when I was playing ATF or USNF Janes from, like, 1997 to 1998. So, I mean, I love me some flight sim. Um, that's why I got involved with Elite Dangerous, because I played Elite 1984. When I was eight... Can you believe that? I was 8 in 84. That is crazy. I'm an old man! <laughs> anyway, though, it was just kind of like, okay. So I really started messing around with it. Um, all right, nobody come in and don't know me to do a hold short on 5. Technically, I'm not on 5. I'm going the other way, I think. I think if it's on 5, you're supposed to have a heading of 5. I think that's how runways work, if I remember right. Seven, five, five, decimal, seven, eight. 
All right, let's just wind up and roll. So, I got involved with, uh, more involved with DCS, and then I started buying more and more modules, then I got the Persian Golf map, um, I started messing around with some of the missions, oops, maybe a slide, there we go, started messing around with, like, the campaigns that came with Flaming Cliffs, because I, I didn't buy DCS Worlds for free, I did buy Flaming Cliffs, so I had all those planes, too. And, uh, let's see, 250, I should start pulling, no, 300, I'm not sure where I'm supposed to start pulling up, now's good, just don't tail strike it, there we go, I don't know, Flaming Cliffs, the campaigns in it were really, really good, um, you know, the A-10 was the basic A-10A model, you know, but it was still a lot of fun, and I was like, blowing up ground targets with Mavericks going, okay, this is awesome, you know, and then I started watching, like, what was it? Uh, the Grim Reapers. They're entertaining. They're super entertaining, by the way. Uh, if you haven't watched them before, they are hilarity sometimes at their finest. There we go. And, um, yeah, I mean, that was pretty cool stuff. I was like, okay, now I'm really involved. And I found Ralphie Dude at the same time I found Grim Reapers. And um, it was the campaigns of the Grim Reapers that really got my attention. Their tutorials are okay if you, like, really want to get started. But what they're giving you is, like, well, the one thing that people don't understand is they're giving you, like, the bare bones to just fly. They're not telling you, like, techniques to use. Oh, there we go. RWR says stuff out this way. Okay. <laughs> we'll keep her throttle up this time and not slow down pull it back to about 60 um so i mean really it's just like okay this is how you set your controls and then you turn around and like you're watching you watch the campaigns you go that's really cool you know um then the tutorials have gotten much better than when i started watching them now they're getting like experts on and things of that nature and uh well i can't okay i can't say experts but you know guys that played DCS Worlds for a long time giving suggestions about things. We'll, we'll put it that way. And, uh, then Ralphie started his Zero to Hero for the A10C. And me and Gwydion started learning it at about the same time. Me and Gwydion Wolf. He hasn't been on for a while. As far as DCS, he's been with, like, playing with Final Fantasy and things of that nature. Uh, but he plans on getting back on, which is awesome! And, uh, can I lock this up yet? I don't think I can. I uh, got it. Okay. Samsite. Looks like it's at the base of the mountain. Not within range at all yet. Cool. So, yeah, we started playing the A10C together. And uh, that was a lot of fun. I got involved in that. And that's like one of the more difficult modules to play with. That thing confused the hell out of me and struggled, until I started watching Ralphie Dude's, uh, like, tutorials. How to do this, how to do that. I still gotta complete them, but that was a lot of fun. And then, uh, I decided I was gonna master the F-14. And let me tell you, the F-14, after you get that baby down, even though it doesn't have fly-by-wire, is so, so damn good. So damn good. I love it. Um, and, you know... Everybody's like, you know, that's the iconic planes. You have 14. Of course you're going to love it. Blah, blah, blah. Well, yeah, sure. But it is not easy to fly. If you're not paying attention, you're going too fast, you will rip the wings off. You will blow the capacitors out of the engines. You will tear yourself in half. You will get shot down. I mean, dogfighting in that thing is uh, unique. Jester helps take a lot of the weight off your shoulders, though. They've improved Jester a lot, in my opinion. Like, you used to be able not to lock a target at all. You just sit there, lock the target! I can't do that! Lock the target! You wait until you're like 15 miles in, and it's like, screw it, I'll lock the target. Okay, now it's dead. Now what? Now he seems to actually do his job and not lose lock at like 50 miles, you know? So, they've made a good amount of improvement on him. The A-10A, I haven't had too much time to play with it. Um, but I want to like do the Fear to Bones campaign after I feel I'm more comfortable with like procedures and things of that nature. Bought it already, by the way. Looking forward to doing it. Um, and I want to do it on stream so everybody can laugh at me die over and over again. Because, let's face it, 
I am a novice, you know. But no, then I started uh I started looking at that, and then I started looking at Jabber's videos, Spud Knockers, uh Ralphy Dudes. I was already in it was already messing with, I was already watching Operator Drewski. Um I mean I really just started diving in head first, man. I didn't just go down the rabbit hole. I, w I became one with the rabbit hole. You know? I like the fact that it's study level. And study level is really cool. And the reason I like study level, if you understand all the controls, gauges, dials, and in particular aircraft, the way they have them modeled in DCS, you can technically, technically, I'm saying technically, fly the airplane. Technically. It's a study level sim. G-forces notwithstanding, and your uh, physical physique, physical health. You know, obviously, flying a simulator, those don't really uh, affect you all that much. Flying a simulator, of course. I don't even know if we got range on this guy yet. Do we have range on this guy? God, I hope so. Losing power. Bring it up more. I lost my ranges. Relock. Got it. There's my ranges. We're getting there. Got to cross the water first. Okay. Got to get down and skim the ocean. See if we can keep that radar off of us. Well, anyway, I started really just watching all these guys. Which they're all amazing, by the way. Go on YouTube, check them out. Ralphie Dew's also a Twitch streamer. Obviously, professional. I am not. I'm a hobbyist, obviously. Uh, but yeah, Jabbers, Ralphie, Red Kite, uh, Operator Drewski, Spud Knocker, Grim Reapers, all of them. I mean, Cap of the Boys are hilarious. <laughs> Ralphie Dude is hysterical. Drewski is pretty damn good. And, and, I mean, they're all funny in their own ways. It's just like, this is really cool. You know, you guys should check them all out. I mean, they're just. Phenomenally amazing. All right, we're getting in the range. Can't tell what's in the way. Looks like something's in the way. All right, got launch authority, but... Uh, you know what? I'm at the max range of launch authority. We're doing it. Yep. Missile out. Rifle. Rifle? I don't know. Or is it Magnum? Whatever. Anti-radiation, go kill that thing, missile out. <laughs> Alright, we need to turn. Why we wait for it to do its job. Or it might be a very bad day for me. It goes. They don't know I'm here yet. They will real soon. Let's notch that radar up. Uh oh. There's this thing. It's called fratricide. I just committed it. Shit. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Son of a bitch. Well, I'm about to be court-martialed. Oh god, it's gonna hit that. <laughs> I, did, I did not do that. Nope, no, 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 no. Didn't see me. Nope, I didn't do it. <laughs> Shit. Again, this is why people with autism and dyslexia do not become fighter pilots. 
It's just bad. Something's happening. Right? Don't let your kids watch it! Uh, do you ever think that something's definitely wrong here? Nothing to see here. Move along, all right? Was that a friendly? Nope. <laughs> yes. Yeah, no, it was. I made a mistake. Again, novice. Autism, dyslexia. I mean, you know, wasn't paying attention. <laughs> My friends, bam. Oops. Well, that went seriously wrong. It could be worse. Could be better. Okay, I gotta check my switches again. Something caused the flaps to go down, and I'm not sure what it was. That's weird. Hang on a second. I seem to be having some serious ghost switching problems going on here. Give me a moment. No, it was definitely friendly. I screwed up. I saw a radar warning. I got uh, launch authority. Forgot the SU-25 does not have an identify friend or foe and just let the missile rip. So that was my mistake. Really horrible mistake. So, yes, I screwed up. <laughs> At least I'll own it in that situation, though. Okay. Ah, I see what it is. All right, hold on. I need to unplug this real quick. You know what I think it is, kids? I think my powered USB hub is dead. Hmm. I wonder if that's the problem with the camera, too. Mm, I smell the magic smoke. Oh, God. Yeah, no, this bitch is fried. Hard my language. Wow. Whoo. Okay. That's done. All right. You know what? Let me flip some things around here. Give me just a moment. I'm going to take my helmet off and see if we can get, the, uh, get some things working here. Give me a sec. That is toasted. So how are we doing today, Auber? And I am dyslexic and autistic. I am going to butcher the crap out of your name. That is just the way it is around here, and I apologize. But how are you doing tonight? <laughs> You're only supposed to break the game, not the equipment. I know! I, I know, Amaki, I know. I understand, buddy. <laughs> Was that a friendly? Nope. <laughs> you saw nothing, right, Zeus? Yeah. My dog's even over here going, Jesus Christ, what are you doing? Mm -hmm. right. uh, let's see, put that there. That there. there. Is it super? Uh, no. Hi, baby. Yes, love the doggy. All right. <laughs> Let's see here. Uh, camera. Yeah. Yeah. All right, let's move that thing. Be that was the problem. I haven't tried it on the other computer yet, but somehow that wouldn't surprise me if that was the issue. You know what? 
Let's give this a go. I would love to have my camera back on for you guys. Seriously. Even though everybody would go, Dear God! Who is this whack job with the long hair? Ow. It would be nice to actually have it. I haven't had my camera in months. To be honest, I'm not sure I want that camera, but, you know. Well, if it works, it works. Alright, let's go to the camera scene here real quick and see if I can get this to fire up. Alright, webcam. Uh, yeah. Whoop. Alright. You know, I'll probably have to mess with the green screen, too. Uh, you know how much I like messing with the green screen? The green screen is always a pain. Never... Uh, never works out. But, huh. Well, that's cool. I came right the heck up. Though, why is it? Why? Right there. Wait. Yeah. <sighs> Whatever. At least you'll see my hand gestures going, oh god, what did I do? Huh. Alright, uh, video config. Apparently, it's got it panned over all the way. Camera control panning! Yes, 4,000... Oh, Jesus Christ. Get back in the center. Get back to center. What are you doing? Okay, cool. That is... Maybe that was the problem. It'd be nice if that is the problem. I don't know. I'll be able to use it again. Sure again. All right, apply. Okay. Let's get it back seated in my scene here. Center it. Sorry, guys. You get to put up with my ugly, ugly face. No, I'm Center to screen. Go. Much better. Much better. Much better. All right. Let's get a filter on it. Yes. Filters. Wow. Boom. Holy crap. I don't have to adjust anything. I just... Um... Sure. Whatever. <laughs> you can see the doggos and the cats once again when the camera's working. Very true. Wow, that green screen just went... I'm working. I mean, okay, I'm really starting to think well, that's probably been broke for a while, then. Huh. I'll take it. Alright, let's get it seated. Excellent. 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 Alright, um, and then, of course, I want to get it in the right spot. Which it's not here. Let's get it back on. Uh, where are you at? Where are you at? Hmm, not here. Okay, I have to re-put the scene back in. Scene. Now, my hair has gotten much longer since I, uh... Since I had the camera last. Much longer. Okay, put that there. That is really... Oh, that, you know, that makes me pretty happy, actually. Nope, 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 nope. I don't want to make it too big. I don't want to make it too small. There we go. Well, that makes me super happy, actually. That's, that's a feel-good moment for me. All right, now I need to go down. Do, 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 do. I'm going to put it there. And lock it. Holy crap, guys. I got my camera back. The only thing that's wrong is the Angry Birds are kind of grayed out. You know what? I'll take that. I'll take grayed out Angry Birds any day. I really will. This is weird. There's no shadows. I'm not fighting with anything. Everything's just... I should shut up. <laughs> I should shut up. I should shut the hell up. Oh, but see how... Yeah. He'll update tomorrow and be broke again. 
by the way, uh, we've just had a massive update to our system. You know, that's the way it'll work, too. It works. Leave it alone. I am. <laughs> Tell them to leave it alone. No, don't touch it. It works. God damn it. Don't, don't mess with it. Leave it alone. Get it over here. Uh, which that's not hard. Where did you go? Stop. Bit that. I move. Did I lose my mouse? Oh, look, I fixed one thing and I lose something. <laughs> it's gone. <laughs> uh, Mr. Mousy, where'd you go? Hmm. Oh, for the love of God. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Well, that's different. So you fixed one problem, but guess what? <laughs> oh, this is not funny. Actually, this is pretty funny. This is actually kind of hysterical. You fix one problem and something else goes wrong. Isn't that the way it always works, though, with, like, anything? It's like, oh, yeah, great, you fixed it. Wonderful. Uh-huh. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, now I'm going to break. And thanks. Thank you for breaking. Oh, there you go. Mouse is back. Okay. Now apparently he wants to disconnect my mouse every time I turn around. <laughs> All right. There we go. Uh, let's get this in here. Sorry, guys. I just really want to recede the. Yep. English, how do? I really want to like seed this stuff back in. Like I had it. Because I always thought it was a, a, you know, kind of one of those things of, uh, you know, having a camera on stream was always kind of a thing, you know. You want people to kind of like know you, see your facial expressions, hand movements, you know, stuff like that. You don't want, uh, you don't want it not to work. And it, you know, I have noticed it does make a difference whether I have a camera or not about how many people actually come in and look and how many people just ignore the channel is all based on whether you have a camera. It's really strange. It's like, did you come here to view the game and see what the community is doing? See a fat guy. I mean, <laughs> I mean, I don't really mean it like that, but I mean, you know, it's kind of like, okay, well, you know, uh, it's cool, I guess. Uh, actually, you know what? Let's remove that. Because I've already got it seated right here. There we go. Right. Oh, uh, that looks... I missed my camera. Coolness. Now it depends if it'll keep working tomorrow. Or if it'll do like it did in the last stream and just lock up and not work. Cause me grief. All right. <clears throat> not that last stream, but you know, the last time I used it on a stream, I really think the uh, USB is going out the window, though. The USB hub. Well, the one USB hub. I got two. The one USB hub definitely took a hike and died. So uh, that would explain that. Looks like audio is still running good. Looks like video is still running good. Looks like, looks like everything's fine. Actually, surprisingly, shockingly. Huh. Yeah, it'll be fine for about a day. <laughs> I'm kidding. It'll probably be fine longer than that. Let's do this again without destroying our own people. That'd be good. <laughs> All right, here we go. Oh, I can just use the MFDs. The only bad part is now everybody gets to see me like jam this thing in my mouth every time I turn around. Which is one habit I wish I could ditch. I've smoked for so many years, though. It's just kind of like, you know. And of course, everybody and their brothers like e cigs are bad. Well, you know, not as bad as the real thing, though. Trust me. All right. 
seems like all this is working. Cool. All right, electrics on. Let's get back in here. Electrics on, kind of closed. Starting engine one. Maybe. Or it may try to start both at the same time. Oh, it's trying to start both at the same time. Damn it, Maki! Jesus. Thank you, sir. Appreciate the 50 bits. Oh. All right. Looks good, sounds good. Not a blurry. I feel like I'm a little high in my seat, though. There we go. Not seeing the server on the list? Really? The Hunter training server should be coming up on the list. All right, let me grab my phone and check firewalls here real quick. Hang on, check one. Okay, uh, let me figure out what I did with my phone. Oh, that's the other thing. You guys get to see how to plug it. Sure, those firewalls are open. That's the other thing. The Comcast. We were having problems with Elite earlier, not being able to connect. It is Jesus phone. Are you... yeah? Oh, hello. Yes. Hi. What up? How do you? What's up? Oh, Rev. I wonder how he's doing. I knew I should have called you. Yeah, about oversleeping. Yeah, that's okay. codes. Yep. All right, check and firewall. Hang on. I mean, the good part about the Comcast app is I can just jump in and go, okay, where are you? Uh, it's really the with firewalls. Wait, you've got load. Give me just a second. <laughs> Watch a key to your Wi-Fi protection. Settings, please. Direction, thank you. Against. Yep, that's the one. 20 security risks! Oh, God. Please, no. Oh, no. What shall we do? One device requires attention. Yeah, it obviously does. I think you guys locked me the hell out of it. Much of the gateway. Look forward to please. Advanced port forwarding. Shut my port forwarding button down. Sorry about that, Chugbug. Got it. Give me a second here. You daffy mother. Freaking. I mean, don't get me wrong. Comcast in my area is probably one of the better ones. But when they do that, I just want to smack them. All right, DCS. Which is sad because I just had somebody on it not long ago. What is it, like 10... I think it's 10.308. Is what I need to set it to. Yeah, 10.308. See, so they got the one here for the SRS radio. 10.308. And we'll set both protocols. Yeah. 
I don't need anything else. No, because that's all steam related and it doesn't matter with this. people to play with me that it come on this yeah thanks Comcast I don't know why people aren't connecting onto the server and having a good time I have no idea apply all right it's updating it might cause a hiccup in stream we'll see what happens it says it updated okay let me check it again here real quick all right 308 all right check it now Chuck one we should be okay that's really super annoying that they do that. I mean, seriously, every time I turn around, they shut my port forwarding off. So if I'm ever doing this because I'm on local, I will always see my server. If you do not see the server or any other server that I'm running on the community, put it in the community server and DM me directly. I will get it fixed. Because Comcast loves to shut my port forwarding off, and I still haven't figured out why. Um... It is stupid, just stupid, stupid annoying um, that they do that. But I don't know. Okay, so try it now. Anybody else that wants to get on, you definitely can. Uh, we're just doing serial foothold. I promise I won't shoot you down. And if I do, you can shoot me down or tell me I'm an idiot on stream. Whatever. Yeah, that's perfectly fine. Right? Yeah, if you guys are interested, we'll do some Syrian foothold. Just hit the follow button. Go to the Discord, get the information out of the Discord. Come and join us. Perfectly fine. SRS radio is open. It is community. I do community every weekend because really the weekend's the only time I really get to play. And so you guys can jump in at any time, whether we're doing Elite Dangerous, DCS Worlds, or whatever. He won't shoot you down intentionally. Thank you. Yes. <laughs> I'm a novice. Um, <laughs> absolutely. Uh, but, you know, if you guys want to jump in, you definitely can. I have no problem. I host the server myself on my secondary computer. And uh, it will hold up to 16 people without a problem. So if you guys want to jump in at the time, absolutely welcome. Everybody's welcome. I, the subs are cool, but that's not why I do this. I do this because I want to get a bunch of people together who have a good time and show off basically show off what it's like there's so many introverts you know like it's like people that play MMOs you, you've seen them they're playing by themselves you're supposed to play the group you know get together with friends I think it'd be easy if we get I always thought it'd be easy if we get a group of people together to just have fun so some people stream for that reason. I stream to get people together to have a good time. In DCS Worlds, you know, even though I'm a novice, I can answer questions, actually. And I think the bigger the community gets and the more well-trained people get, the more we can get people involved and have a good time with it. You know, or Elite Dangerous, or anything else that somebody might want to So, but yeah, we do a lot of different things. We were going to start up an ARC server, but... Mm, Arc is one of those things that uh, it requires 500 gigs now. <laughs> I don't have the room to spare. I need to buy a new hard drive just for that. So. But yeah. <clears throat> SRS radio is the same IP address. Different port number. I just use the default port. Um, but if anybody gets disturbingly bad, I would just... So please respect to everybody who plays in this, um, especially novices like myself or anybody else is a novice. 
as long as everybody shows respect, and um, I'm never going to have a problem. I have had to kick people out in the past, obviously. So that's everybody's warning. Will not hesitate to ban or kick somebody if they are disrespectful or anything like that. Nature. Let's get back into this. Let's see if we can get these Sams off the board. Actually, it looks like it's starting to get dark. It might just be cloud cover. Which is not good because this thing does not have night vision. Okay. Let's get the window back in focus here. Drop that. Drop that. Put that there. I'll never shoot anybody down attention. Are you kidding me? That's mean. That's rude. That's rude. All right. Let's do this. Engines are up. Both, everything looks normal. Gas is good. Weapons are reset. Don't shoot the destroyer and carrier again. And let's do this. Oh, it looks like Chuckabug's on there. Cool. As soon as he gets on comms, or if he gets on comms, I'll see if he's there. No, that might be our screwing up. Urgh. I may have to restart the game from all the plugging in and unplugging. It's the second time it's grayed out on me like that. I don't know why she's bouncing. Bouncy little thing today. Come on. Breaks her off. There you go. down to the next one. Blind as a bat. I think it's actually getting dark out. DC crashed your back? Okay. Well, I got my firewalls fixed. Comcast apparently killed them. So you're more than welcome to log in, Chugbug. No problem. Thank you for letting me know that you couldn't find it. Why does it feel like I got a broken landing gear? Gee, many Christmas. Boing, boing. Looks like, it sounds like I, look, looks like I got a flat tire. Hold on. I might have a flat tire, actually.
That's strange. I mean, I didn't even move. have a flat tire? I mean, it really kind of feels like it. I have no front gear for some reason. What the heck happened there? Mm -hmm. Only flat on one side. Well, apparently I, I, I am set up to take off from a railway. That's kind of interesting. All right, ground crew. Hmm. This is gonna be a mess. How did I break my tire? I don't understand. I didn't even move. Okay, you know what? I'm I'm not even worried about it. Nope. I'm just gonna bounce, bounce, and there we go. Then we'll check the plane out thoroughly. Something must have been happening when I was undoing the, uh, when I was setting up the firewalls. Okay, let's look. Look over the plane. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything looks good. Looks good. Looks good. No problems. Yeah, yeah, okay. You don't get it. Electrical on. Can it be closed? Okay. Yeah, that's strange. We go. Engine one start. Yeah, these FC planes, I mean, even though they're simple models, it looks so good. Engine one up the speed. Engine two. Get that started. All right, for that to rev up. It's only flat on one side. It's fine. It's only flat on one side. Just put a skid on it. Nobody will notice. All right, flaps check. Okay, looks good. Okay. Now let's see if I can actually accomplish something. Ha ha! That'd be good, right? All right, we're setting ready to roll. Let's do it again. There we go. Still feels like it's dragging. I don't know. All right. I'm just double checking it here, make sure I'm not crazy. Should be right there. This one right here. Right.
There's not a parking brake or anything like that I need to worry about on this plane, I don't think. It just feels really funky. Okay. Oh, there actually is a night vision floor. Ah. Now, what did I set that to in the time? Oh, wait. Yeah, I do. Yeah, not this. Okay. Alright, everything looks fine. Okie dokie. I'm bouncing again. No, I'm okay. I'm okay. Make you sure. Don't have the map. Oh, you don't have the Syrian map? Oh, really? Well, that's a bummer. I mean, I can change it to the Caucasus foothold. That's not a big deal. It'd take me like two seconds. It'd be to literally walk behind the curtain and press the button. <laughs> yeah, the Syrian map's amazing, though. No, no, no worries. It doesn't bother me at all. Trust me. Trust me. It doesn't bug me one bit. All right, we're going to do a rolling takeoff. Dodge 2 1. Unable to clear for takeoff. Don't care. Doing it anyway. Thank you. Don't look behind the curtain! Oh god. Hmm. Rotate up. And we're up. Okay, flaps up. All right, we're rolling.
I mean, the Syrian map is gorgeous. I definitely recommend that as a buy. I was completely... Uh, I mean, I had Persian Gulf. And they're like, oh, the Syria map. I'm like, oh, okay. Eh. And I was just like... Honestly, I wasn't interested. Oh, well. After stream tonight, I will turn on the training server and you can log in and play with it as much as you want. That's fine with me. I'll put it on the NZ Arma training. Now you can train with the rest of us people who can't fly, too. It'll be fun. Heaven forbid if we ever got somebody that actually knows how to fly fly. I don't think we would know it. I, I, I don't... Well... Uh, VR, stop it. I don't think I would know what to do at that point. I think I would just be totally blown away. No problem, man. It's anytime it's not up, DM me on Discord. I just walk into the computer room and I press the button and fix it. That that's it. So I will keep always keep it up and running. Uh, the password, of course, is in the Discord server. You know, I've got no problem maintaining it. It's on a uh, it's on my older 3700X AMD. That's got 64 gigs of RAM and a. Uh, 3070 on it, so I mean I could probably actually other than bandwidth, I could probably have a lot more people than 16 on it, but uh, yeah alright, so back this way go around and re not shoot the carrier <laughs> do not shoot the carrier repeat after me do not Right? Do not. Shoot. Uh-huh. Yep, shoot. The carrier! Those guys right there, don't shoot them! Don't do it. It's bad. I have gotten so spoiled about Jester doing the IFF stuff for me. No, I didn't even... Mm. Hang on. Oh. Oh. That could be an issue. My other sensor's covered. <laughs> I wonder if she'll fly straight. Eh, she's flying straightish. Note to self never do this when you're flying a plane. See if that makes it behave a little bit better. Sensors all moved. It is definitely a bishop stream. Hey, look, I didn't die. Imagine that. Okay. And actually, the 
Yeah. Okay, yep, we're good. I got it. Feels a little weird. I'm gonna re recenter anyway, though, just to be sure. There we go. Looks like I got a blue guy over there. So we do have blue AI flying around too. Cool. Now if I'm right, this valley will go all the way through. Sensor's not pointed at me. It's like pointed off to the side. Arr! Sorry. Every time it shifts like that, I can't breathe. Me. It's because the sensor is not where it should be. That's the problem. Uh, temporary. Uh, though I am waiting on Eagle Dynamics to turn around and tell me what my issue is with open beta. Because I've been talking around on the forums. I'm not the only one having the problem, but all of us who are having the problem with open beta apparently shouldn't be having the problem with open beta. So it's really kind of an interesting situation. And everybody's trying to figure out why, but so far... None of us have any answers. Alright. Um, that's a deeper valley. Let's go that way. Famous last words. <laughs> 800 meters through a valley. Yeah, this should be fun. Stay below the hills. Just need to remember, this is not a viper. She will not turn on a dime. And I'm going to have to give her lots and lots of love. Not just pray she'll do it. Really chew it through the gas, though. Why is it everything that's Russian built just eats gas? You ever notice that? It's like gas, guzzle, 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 guzzle. It's like really, come on. Why do you drink all gasolines? There we go. That's not friendly. No, definitely not friendly. Oh shit. Got a plane coming in too. Uh, yep. That's plane. No, that's a parachute. Okay. Never mind. I was incorrect. That is not uh, what I thought it was. Alright. Let's get on this here. Locked. We have launch authority. I am pretty sure that's not friendly. Um, hard to say, though. 
Oh no, definitely not friendly. All right, turn off, turn off, turn off, turn off. Notch that shit, notch that shit. Looks like I'm in the clear. Yeah, the missile hit the ground. All right, let's bring it back around and do it again. Come on, baby. Son of a bitch, he sees me already? Well, that's great. Locked. Firing. There we go. At least that's something. I had two missiles just slammed into the ground. All right, so apparently there's a launch ceiling on those, and I was way too low. All right, the lost lock. Boom! All right, now we're talking. I like how I damaged myself. That was hilarious. Obviously, I did damage myself. Well, that'll make a fun replay. I killed something! Okay. So let's do that again. These missiles need more clearance. Right. Yeah. Friendly aircraft out there. Cool. Blue player commander bishop and SU-25 killed blue player commander bishop. <laughs> I shot myself down and crashed. <sighs> oh, that's awesome. Yep. Pro pilot. Right here. Oh my god. Alright, second engine coming up. I knew I was in trouble when I heard that thud. I was like, uh oh. This is what happens a missile drops off the wing. Apparently that one. And it's that big guy right there. Instead of just launching from the wing and moving forward, it drops off the wing like a phoenix and then takes off. And since I was only 40 off the ground, it just basically fell off and hit the ground. <laughs> it exploded. And it exploded right under me. So, oops. That's a... Uh, I wonder if that counts as a kill. Huh. Oh. I'm sorry, that's funny. To me, that's hilarious. One of these days, though, I'll be really good at this if I keep this up. I know I will be, it's just... It takes me longer to get these things down. Okay... Okay. There we go. All right, let's move. Taxi to five. 
would mean over there. Somebody's going. Oh, it's a cargo plane. Apparently they're trying to get cargo, so... Oof, one of the... Hey, look, I'm not paying attention again. Imagine that. There we go. To one of the bases. Oh, I feel thump, thump, thump. Well, I'll just roll with it, whatever. I have to say, the sound mod is very good. Explosions, hits, missiles. Yeah, I'm digging this. I'm curious to see what the replay is going to look like. It's probably going to look really good, actually. means I'll probably have to invest in track view. Oh look, we're front landing gear popped again. Jesus. You know what? It could stay broken. I will get off the ground without it. I either A turned too hard or that little light broke it. I bet that little light broke it. Yeah, I think it's crazy. So many people give up on DCS, though, honestly. I, I always found that a little odd. There we go. Because if you just keep plugging at it, eventually you're going to get good at it. I think you will. Oh. What do I know? Right? What do I know? I feel like I'm like... I'm flying a plane with hydraulics. Should have the right type of music on for that. All right. Uh, <laughs> here we go. How's this going to go? Well, probably horribly. You know, whatever. I could probably stop it from shaking so bad. If I force the nose down, maybe a little. We'll see. We'll give it a shot. Alright, flaps down. They still work. Okay, good. Landing is going to be the hard thing. I'm probably going to wreck it all over the deck. Take off. Eh. It'll be rough. I'll give myself a few more inches, I think. Okay, I'm good. Let's do this.
push her all the way up and then push the nose down try to keep it stable as possible yeah she's already trying to lift holy crap the hell are you doing crazy plane Come on. There we go. Gear up. Hopefully center gear locks into place. Looks like we're golden. Indicators say that everything's good. Here we go. I just gotta remember that gear is broken when I hit the ground. Well, the wheel. I probably won't even make it back, but you know, well, what the hell. Alright, that's the carrier. This is gorgeous, man. Sorry, I... I still have, like, shiny syndrome. I've been playing DCS in VR forever, and every time I get into it, it's like... Ooh! Ooh! Ooh, look at this! Look at that! Look at that! Squirrel! You know, I mean, obviously, like I did earlier today. Squirrel tree! Dead! <laughs> it's a great game, though. I mean, really. It's been around forever, and... I don't know, it just keeps getting better. Alright, let's lay off the throttle so we don't burn all the gas. I'm thinking maybe I should have switched some of that out for gas tanks. I don't know if I really need to. I, mean, I really don't want to fire up the ECM until things start shooting at me. Because, you know, ECM. Oh, that's good. Cut that down. Go. Yeah, I'm thinking I should move the air brake to the paddle on the the, uh, the stick. <laughs> Excuse me. Now we got the air brake right here instead of a push button over here. I've been really debating that. It's like you know, I should really do that. And then I have my auto disconnect and my pinky. So I've got the paddle for the air brake and the disconnect right there at my pinky. That'd probably work out better, actually, because then, you know, with the uh, F-16 EX, the paddle is spring-loaded. It's really good stuff. And so you can, like, pull the paddle in, you know, like, pull it in like that. And then I forgot I got a camera so you can actually see it. Pull it in with these two fingers like that, air brakes out, and then let it go, and it, it there's another switch on the let go action, so it brings it back in. 
and then have the uh, pinky disconnect on the button behind it. I think that might be a, a good way to do it, because right now I got it on the uh, autopilot disconnect there, and I don't know how I feel about that. I think I like the idea of the autopilot disconnect at the pinky switch, since that's got nothing on it right now. And then this is for air brake. It might be useful because, like, you know, you'd have more command of your air brake. You know, you pull it when you need it, and then you just let go and forget about it. Because too many times in combat, I have turned the air brake on and forgot it was there. <laughs> okay, did I get any speed? Oh, you know, one of those deals. Actually, I'm still in a safe spot. You know what? Let's test that. Let's see how that feels. Uh, yeah, let's do that. I like that idea. I like that idea. Air brake on, air brake off. Okay. So, air brake on. Would be that. Okay, air brake off would be that. Alright, let's see how that works. Oh. Oh, that's gorgeous! Oh, I love it! That is cool! That is so cool! Damn it, Wingwin. Why did you have to make good stuff? Oh, that's gonna be so helpful. Just let go and forget about it. And so many planes. God. F-16, 14, all that stuff. Now I can put that on my throttle somewhere else. And not worry about the air brake, because I could just... You know, when I need it, you know, just pull this back. And then just let it go. Probably help on those carrier landings, too. Because we all know how hard I land in F-14. Oh, God. Okay, so I have to have altitude for these guys. Or it'll be a very bad day for me. Because of that drop down. Clear this for something else. I don't know what to put here now. I wonder what I could put here. Probably something cool. I just don't know what. F-14, there's the wing sweep is that button. I don't know what it is on the F-18. I haven't used the 18 in a while, though. I probably would fly it horribly. And I don't know how to use harms in the 18, which is why I'm not using an 18. Which is going old school. Which, honestly, this thing for seed work, it does pretty well when it has a decent pilot in it. You know what? I'm going to ease over this way. Yeah, let's ease this way. And fuel is at three. Okay. Receptors or anything see me, we should be all right. I mean, I've got some air to air missiles, but I don't know, man. MiG 29 comes after me, I'm dead.
Damn it, VR, don't do that. Let's go between here. I really don't want to go above the peaks of the mountain. Mm. Sorry. Wow. Oh, shit. That sucked. Mm, vomit comet time. Wow. No oh, sensors. Yep, sensor problems. Goody sensors. Please don't do that to me when I'm trying to shoot something. All right, get down, get down, get down, get down, get down. Down, 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 down. Something's not happy to see me, that's for sure. I don't see any missile launches. Alright, I gotta get closer. Pull up. I got it, Pull I got up. it. Shh, 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 shh. It's okay. I got it. There we go. Really? Come on, I can't... The f Great. Gray VR screen. Wonderful. Come on. Uh. There we go. All right, bring it up. Jeez. Timing on that was horrible, wasn't it? Oof. Looks good. All right, she's down. Uh, that ain't happening. Now what? We're just gonna go overhead and pray to God there's not AAA here, too. Yep. I don't know where they're at, but that's okay with me. Come on. I know. Not really made for this. I get it. Come on, baby. Come on, Frogfoot. There you go. All right. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Lock her up, lock her up, lock her up. Gotcha. Firing. Or not. Okay. Too close. Damn it. Fire that then. No? What about that? No. Gotcha. I'm just way too close. I didn't see any missile racks pointed this way though. Okay, up over the trees. Let's get some distance. Grand crew down there is like, what's that frogfoot doing? <laughs> just, I mean, somebody shot at me, but or at least locked me. But those guys are like sleeping or something. I got lucky as hell that they did not fire at me. Seriously. That's the only reason I'm still alive is because they were just like, I don't know, maybe they couldn't get a lock on me for some reason. It's 
hard to say. Come on, slow down. There you go. All right. There you are. Let's get you locked back up. Okay, launch authority good. Firing. Here we go. Missile away. Peel it off. Slightly. Looks straight and true. Oh, and he blows him in the next week! I like it. I like it. Alright, SA-13 site. Come on. There we go. Got it. Not in range yet. The missiles are there, but they got no radar running them. Awesome. Okay, now we're back in the... Now we're getting in the groove. Launch authority's good, but it's still kind of far away. Give it a second here. Okay, nope. No seconds here. Um, missile away. Turn, 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 turn. There we go. He's got a lock. Okay, now he's fired. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I don't see the missile. I don't see it. Nope. Don't see it. Nope. Oh, yes, I do. Okay. Up we go. There it is. It's trying to track. No, you don't. I got your ass. EOS failure. Yeah, MLWS failure. ECM failure. ACS failure. Let's see what my missile does. I still get you. Hydraulic failure. E-O-S. Rock on. God, I love those explosion sounds. That's so good on this mod. Not bad. Got three. Oh. I'm going to have to restart my client, I think. Mm. That's getting old. Okay, so we got to solve that sensor problem because I put the green screen up and, you know, and the crowd goes wild! Mm -hmm. Darn right. Oh, wait, I got to do it the right way. Sorry. My bad. I didn't do it correctly. And the crowd goes wild! There we go. That's better. Mm -hmm. If it worked, I don't know if it worked or not. Got him, though. Not bad for a novice. Got three? No. I'll take three to one. Three to one when I don't know what I'm doing? Yeah. Well, I don't know what I'm doing. I'll take it. It's a good sign. Usually it's like one to one or two to one. So, cool. All right. So I got to restart my client, though. Thankfully, I'm on a server, so I just reconnect. Because SteamVR is having a conniption fit. My God. It really doesn't like what I'm doing to it. It's like, no, mm, just no, mm. <laughs> not just no, hell no. All right, exit. Actually, you know what? Now would be a good time for a break. Uh, so let's see, 10 o'clock, uh, let's say 10 minute break and then jump back into this. And then I'm going to see if, uh, if I can get this VR situation worked out with my sensors because it is acting pretty squirrely. I don't think these lights are messing with the sensors. I think it's just that sensor is now higher and it's just causing issues. And it's also green screens in the way. You know, I had to kind of like move it around because honestly, I didn't anticipate ever uh, putting the green screen back up until I got a new camera. And that was going to be months from now. I don't know. I'll see if I can get it worked out. But anyways, I'll be right back, guys.
No, I haven't seen it. Looks good. Which, <clears throat> just check this thing. We are. It likes it over there. So that's a good sign. It's good for me. Gray on Vomit Fest should stop. God, I hope it's gone. Because, oh my god. Ugh. Good lord. Yeah, it just kind of makes you want to go, Whoa. I got it. Yeah, it doesn't go well. Okay, so let me look at the. We're going to work on this scene here real quick. So what I'm going to do, um, I'm having fun, but hmm, the old map is definitely showing me that I need more training time. So we're going to go back to some, some training maps, training maps. And of course you're welcome to join if you want, because I need more, uh, kind of jumped there. I'm going to have to keep an eye on you. I definitely need more training time. Well, let's see. I want to. Give me a second here. No, I want to root a scene. 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 Uh, in game. Horizontal? Is that right? Is it horizontal? I think so. Uh, huh? Uh, okay. It's weird because there's two pictures of me there. <laughs> It's kind of odd. Not exactly what I wanted to do, but it's close. I think I crop that off. Yep, I'll crop that. <clears throat> Let's see, put you there. And then, well, actually. Yeah, you know, I'm always trying to figure these things out. I always try to figure out what's best, what looks good, you know. And sometimes I, some days I get it, and some days it looks horrible. I think we'll just do that. One of these days I'm gonna figure out how to slant it, put it on that back screen there. <laughs> so it's like, you know, one of these days I will figure that out. Till then, I'll just leave that alone. But uh, anyway, <clears throat> all right, so let's jump in. So, yeah, I think I got it worked out. Let me go reset the server here real quick. Um, and then uh, we'll try some training stuff. See if I can get in the swing of using uh, using the T or the SU-25 again as far as, uh, you know, radar, anti-seed, that sort of thing. And not shoot my friends. Oops. All right, Steam VR says, "Yeah, found the sensor, no problem. Looks good, no issue there. All right, that's awesome. Let me go set that up here real quick. Let me take a second. Gotta click a button. It's really it. You just gotta click a button. Why is that the same thing? Nope. Yep. Yeah. Okay. And." Oh, And run. I'm on Syria. Bing. Please, wait. Loading! Please wait! Loading, please wait. And the armor's loaded. Yay! Cool. 
All right, so let's get going. If you guys want to jump in on it, you definitely can. Now all the firewall stuff is taken care of. We can definitely get to it. All right, I got to reset my audio engine. Because I took the headset off, then I put it back on, and now it's going, I don't know what to do with myself. There we go. Okay. So yeah, Chuck Bug, if you want to get on, you definitely can. That's fine with me. SRS radio should be working. And anybody else who wants to jump on, of course. Can't wait until I get Grimmy and uh, all of his stuff and get everybody going here again. Great. There we go. Yep, not great now anymore. It's not giving me any problems anymore. Cool. I don't know if these Sams will shoot back. They should. Unlike those tanks. Those tanks never shoot back for some reason. I don't know why. Please wait. I'm waiting. There it goes. thinking about it anyway. And see, one of the things you gotta remember is the SU-25T, which is the one I'm flying, isn't even that they offer with DCS. Seriously. Which I think is totally cool. Alright. Blue. Go. Let's find our little guy here. That's why I always say, if you want to give it a shot, give it a shot, you know, because this guy's free. <clears throat> the SU-25 is actually free, and it works very well. It is actually a very, very capable plane for uh, ground support, and it does okay. You know, as far as... Uh, it does okay with the, the, the missiles on air-to-air. -air. All right, I think that was just it loading in. Give me the uh, run around there. All right, loading in. There we go. All right, let's set our plane up. Uh, Rearm refuel. Full fuel. There we go. I see pods. Yeah, it's daytime. Let's see, we could take other pods if we want, but I really don't see a point. So let's take the uh, long range improved missiles. FBI, open up! <laughs> oh god, thank you, Omaki, for the heart attack. FBI, open up. Jesus Christ! Hmm. I'm fine. I'm totally good! 
Uh, all right, what was the FBI open up about? Something wrong, or because I couldn't see my chat? Nope. Okay, cool. <laughs> Everything's fine. Okay. <laughs> Thank you for the 50. Oh, God. Damn it. Mm. All right, maybe we still got a few VR problems. Maybe it's my hair that's in the way. Shit. Who knows? I always hated that, though. It just grays out and acts crazy. Ugh. Vomit worthy when it does that shit. And trust me, it doesn't ever do it. Ever. And then it just randomly it's like, <laughs> FTB? Okay. Why not? Request rearming. What is FTB? Copy. Apparently it's just the standard paint job. Okay. Cool. So yeah, we'll practice our seed stuff. Because, I mean, Syrian was cool. I like Syrian foothold. Man. There's so much more practice I've got to do in order to uh, get better at this. And I got so used to the uh, the Gladiator as far as how it feels. Rearming complete. That going to this wing win, the, and I'm not bitching, the F-16EX is great. It is an amazing stick, but they feel completely different. The curvatures on them are different too. It's like the Gladiator. Dang it. VR, stop it. Okay, now I'm getting frustrated. What is the deal? Hmm. Anyways, like I was saying, the curvature is so different on that. Let me this Can I turn that light off without an issue? Uh, not really. Definitely creates a shadow. Yeah, okay. Let's sort it out. At some point, I'll sort it out. There we go. That's not so bad. Index really doesn't normally have this problem. Sorry. I just hate it when it does that. It makes me sick to my stomach. That the VR just go blank screen on you is just so annoying. And Steam VR is notorious for that lately. Today? <laughs> Today's being the lately. Anyways, like I was saying. Yeah, definitely gets more training though in. So yeah, NZ Arma is up. It is the training map that we use. So anybody wants to join definitely can. Engine one spooling up. Make sure my switches are set right. Or something bad happens. Okay. Looks good. Engine one spooled up. Let's pull up engine two. Oh, starting engine two. Canopy. All right, engine two is started. All right, looks good. Let's do it. Clear to taxi to runway one zero. 
<laughs> Watch out, squirrels! Bishop's on the way! Little hairy vermin. Darn right. You know, Rev wanted to call me Caveman as my call sign, but at this point, considering I keep crashing and dying, I think we're... That might actually end up being my call sign. Crash 1-1. One, one. <laughs> or Squirrel 1-1. One, one. <laughs> there we go, Squirrel 1-1. One, one. Because call signs are never cool. They're always something personally bad about you. That's the way call signs work. Eslon, Springfield, 1-1. One, one. Request takeoff. Springfield, 1-1. One, one. Cool. All right, let's do this. So I think I want to take, I'm trying to pull back at about, what's it, 270, 280, something like that? I don't know, it's something like that. Except I'm seriously running out of runway. Oh crap. Alright, come on. Up, 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 up. Get your nose up. Cute. It has begun! Well, that went wrong. All right, where am I on this runway? I thought I was at the edge of the runway. I bet I wasn't. That's probably like center point on the runway. Again, reason they don't let autistic people become... Uh, I, oh, God, no, I was, a, I was center of runway. No wonder. Shit, see, I thought this was the end. Oh, Christ. So I tried to take off with about half a runway. Yeah, I can't do that without an afterburner, so I need to travel here, go here, hang a left, go all the way down, use the turnaround, and then take off. Gotcha. Oops. Well, live and learn, I guess. Could be worse. All right. Electrical up. Ground. Refill your arm. One of these days, I'm not going to make these mistakes. One of these days. Not today. Today it's how many mistakes can I make? And is it funny? <laughs> I think it's fucking hilarious. <clears throat> Pardon my language. I mean, I really do think it's hilarious. Cougar 12, Cougar 12. Oh wait, are those the improved? You know what? That one. And then Archer and yep. And yep. And yep. And improved, updated. Improved, updated. And where's the big boy? There she is. Okay. Uh, you know, I want to see what that one looks like. Request rearming. Copy. It's kind of... Looks like a... Interesting. <laughs> it's got like this little camo patch and then the... Didn't like that plane anyway. Next! Exactly. My computer is just having a ton of issues here. Dang, man. Yeah, you know, if I ever had a day that things worked properly, I wouldn't know what to do with myself. 
I'm waiting for it to gray out a second time. Or something. Because I don't know what it is doing today. It's really not nice. I wonder if it has... No. Uh, maybe. You know what? It might be. Hmm. You know what? Give me a second. I want to try something. We're going to lose the camera on the stream, but uh, I have this crazy idea that I think I... I think I might know what's going on. I might. Maybe. There's definitely something going on because my headset's going to be Okay, give me a second here. Bye bye, Mr. Camera. <clears throat> Pull you out here real quick. Wow! What was that? Mm. Echo, 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 echo! Okay, sure. Okay. Let's get back here. See what's happening. Ooh. Well, that would be a good reason, too. What the hell? Alright. Get out of there. Just get out of there. Give me the call. you're coming with me. Good evening! How are you doing tonight? Don't mind me, I'm having technical issues. Mm -hmm. I am solving said technical issues. I hope. We'll see if it solves the technical issue. You know, I bet it's this and this competing with the VR. So how are we doing, Adam? Go. Oh, you just finished your stream? Oh, nice, dude. How'd it go, man? Good, I hope. Okay. Um. Okay. So we're gonna move the camera. I really think that's it. That's gotta be it. I can't think of any other reason all of a sudden I would have problems with VR headset. Something funky. Nice! Here we retro games are fun. Totally 100% support that. Right there. Retro games! In somewhere. Okay. Where's your computer? No, I don't, don't catch the thing. Oh, oh. Is it that? Is that? Is something? Oh, I feel like it was. Should be. Was. Of course, it's not in this. Arco 1 1 on station at Bulls 2 5 5 for 45 at 6000. Man, two 
do 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 USB shuffle. I wonder if that's a thing. USB shuffle. That should be a thing now. Downloaded DCS, haven't had a chance to touch it yet. Oh, well, you know. Why? Razer Gaming Software wants to install. Well, that's a good sign. Magic and one, no, one, one station not. at Bulls 256. Wait! Let's cancel, Because I don't need you! Oh, yeah, I'm actually flying the, uh... I'm actually flying the TU-25, which is the free plane that you get from DCS. Well, that is a funny picture. It's, like, locked on that when I disconnected it. That's hilarious. Okay, not that one. Use uh, something else. And up the back. And find whatever. <laughs> really? Well, it wants to be a pain. It actually can't see the camera. The camera died again. Ah, I want to scream so much right now. That's that's just I don't I don't even know. Mm, that's like migraine worthy right there. It's like why. Why are you this way? Why must you fight and argue? And to Brute! Oh, wait. That's right. I still was dead. Because it burned up tonight. Okay. Apparently, the camera does not like PCIe cards. Fine. We will plug you directly into the motherboard. But I can see. Maybe. Possibly. Plug it in. Oops. Why? What is with the tension on the board? Tension on the Bastard. Okay. All right. Maybe. Possibly. Could be. Perhaps. Snuggles? <sighs> Congratulations, yada yada blah blah. No. <laughs> I want none of that. Thank you. I don't need any of the gaming software. Yes, go away. We have drivers. Oh, God. All right, two seconds. I'm going to just bust stream restart it real quick. It'll only take a second because of the way this is set up now. It'll only take a minute to reinitialize. So give me just a moment and I'll be right back. was fast, right? Do I need a bigger hammer? Yes. D do you got one I can use? Somewhere. Anywhere. <laughs> Good God, man. I don't know. I may have lost the camera altogether again. It's just acting so squirrely. Ah. You know, it doesn't make any sense whatsoever why it's acting like this. All right. Uh, apparently, since the USB hub fried, I'm going to need to restart the computer. Now, that will take a little longer. So I might have one over here. <laughs> there you go. Uh, now, I'll still be able to rechat, and it'll still be connected, but this will only take me a second. Again, I'm sorry the stream has been just chock full of technical difficulties. Um, you know, sometimes... 
Sometimes things work, sometimes things don't. It's just the way it is, unfortunately. Um, but yeah, this thing is totally off the rails right now. So hold on, I'm going to restart the computer, and I'll be right back. Won't take long, M2 drive. So uh, yeah, give me a minute. Everything's coming back. There we go. That looks good. Connect. Okay, reconnect. We have picture. Yes, we do. We got sound, at least the microphone. So we're going in the right direction. Now, what about this stupid video thing? We need to knock it stupid here in a minute. It really is pushing my buttons. Activate. It says no. Okay. You know what? Goodbye. Boom. And then... Talking you. Yep. Remove. Yes. Why, thank you. Okay. Webcam. Riyadh. This is why I seat my scenes in. Etron. Really? the hell's e-tron all right so now we got that back make your video let's pan back i to wonder if i need to check my board for damage from that usb hub going up like it did kind of hoping not starting to wonder if there's an issue lock lock and yeah you're what I want some my trigger fire is trying to move all that just needs to stop let's put you back in the middle where you belong there you are okay filters activate chroma key yes green now there's a huge shadow over here for some reason it's because of the door. Okay, shadow fix. Is that my mic? That's my mic. Okay. Oh, it's just my microphone. All right. Well, looks good. Okay. Now that's working. So one problem solved. Okay. Uh, let's see. Talking. I don't have it. Oh, yeah, I do. There you are. Go here. Add video existing. Give me yes. Boom. Boom. Okay, that looks good. Let's check intermission. Make sure it's working. 
Back in business. All right. Wow. Just, yeah. Wow today. It's trying, isn't it? All right, chatbot. Let's get it back online. Yes, please. Thank you. Okay. Did you have a vault? Uh, I had a three. I had a powered USB three hub. This guy. It burned up. Right in the middle of the stream, I was like, "Why do my MFDs keep unplugging?" And then I was like, "Oh, something's hot over here." Hold this. Start sniffing around. Magic smoke, man. Toast. I've had this for about five years though, so I can't say it didn't do its job. But just and things have been kind of hectic since. VR's been acting weird. Computer's been acting weird. Everything's just weird. Just kind of went a uh, little loony. Little loony. Which is okay. I mean, you know, as long as it's not permanent. That's why I did just the forced restart and let's try again. So, so far, it seems to be okay. Yeah, which it really shouldn't. I mean, DC 5 volt A, but you know, 4 A. No, they really shouldn't have sent more than 12 back. So I think we're fine. Just fried it. So I wouldn't see why I would do that. I don't even think the plug is registered at 12 volts. I mean, it should be five. Just, I mean, I don't know. Like I said, five years old, though, which is no big deal. I got another USB hub. It's just like you sit there and just go, are you serious right now? <laughs> you know, what the hell? Why is this a thing? Yeah, exactly. Shouldn't have. Okay. Speaking of, I just dove off the table now. You know what? You just Go over there. Throw you in the trash can later. Oh, that's a good picture. Oh, there we go. Hey. Look at that. All right. Okay. Let's get back on the server. Seems promising. Let me reset my audio engine since the VR sound is now on. Make sure it recognizes. And... There we go. Looks good. Let's get the music back on. And back to it. Yeah, the VR was just like going crazy, and it was just like starting to turn into happy vomit. It's like, I don't want to puke everywhere. Thanks. It was just getting out of control. All right, Amaki, have a good night, man. Take it easy. I will catch you later, and I've got it. Uh, so thank you for the luck. I might still need it later on. Okay, here we go. Anzi mm, Arma. Let's get it going. My desk is such a disaster right now. From the plugging in, unplugging, moving monitors, and everything else. Good lord. stuff loads up man just woof there we go now let's get back in that su25 shall we there we are okay throttle set actually for a okay yeah there, left and right are separate from one another okay That was a lot cleaner. 
petals. Stick is good. All right. Throttle should be okay. Let's get armed up. And then let's go after some... Uh, go after some Sam's, shall we? All these Russian made missiles. Russian missiles everywhere! Pods. There we go. Lasky! Thank you for the resub, dude. Greatly appreciate it, man. How you doing? Let's go with a uh, standard one. There we go. Request rearming. How we doing, man? Okay. Wait for them to get the. You're okay? Well, that's good. I'm doing okay. I've blown a USB hub. Stream is. I had to restart stream. Uh, it's been a day of technical issues, man. Let me tell you. I think we got it, though, kids. I think that computer restart did the job. It must have, like, thrown some of the software just way out the window when that thing just gets. Seriously. Uh, DCS is going. Steve VR was having a little bit of an issue. But like I said, I blew my USB 3 hub. So. Yeah. Sounds like fun and games. Oh, it's been a just mess today. Um, my flying hasn't been the greatest, but it, you know, not terrible. It's just not been the greatest. But it's been all right. All right, we are loaded. Electrical on. So, anyway, so, yeah, Adam, this is the SU-25. Very simple, free plane. It comes with DCS. Like you said, you downloaded it, so there you go. Um, I like it. It is the it is basically the Russian version of the A-10. Some hardware needs to be replaced, sounds like. Uh, the hub just, you know. Yeah, I need to get myself a new hub. I've needed to get a new hub for a while. Why does it look like my flaps are broke already? What's going on with that? Magic one one on station at bulls two six zero for fifty at thirty thousand. It's weird. Getting an odd indication there. Might be because I'm not powered. Yeah, it looks like they're just hanging. Okay. That's fine. Alright. Let's kick on engine one. Chugbug's on! Hey, Chugbug. See if he's got SRS running. Alright, engine one coming up. We're afraid to spool up all the way and then come down and then we'll start the second engine. And then we will go taxi all the way down to the end of the runway instead of trying to take off halfway like an idiot and go for there. I'm going to lurk. I'm downloading 100 gigabytes worth of stuff. Ouch. Okay. Engine ready. Engine two. Let's cycle her up. Starting right engine. This is why I like the, the Flaming Cliff planes, though. Because they work just like the free plane. Really, just to get them started, all you need to worry about is electrical. Well, arm it, electrical. Then it, engine one, engine two, close the canopy, go. That's that's it. And then learn how to actually fly it, you know. Damn, I remember those days, right? All right. Weapons checks are coming back. Air brakes are working. Looks like all surface controls are working. Flaps are up. 
completely. And foot pedals are working. All right, let's roll. Now I gotta figure out where one zero's at. Should tell me. One zero, that way. Oh, this is one zero. Okay. So we wanna go all the way down to the end. Right. And we don't want to run on the runway. We kind of want to run on the side of the runway. Chugbug either. Chugbug. I don't know if Chugbug has SRS radio. He's gonna see what he was up to. Got the long range anti radar missiles up. SAM sites are already scanning out in the area. Okay, good. Coming up on the edge of the other night? No SRS. Okay, no, that's cool. No problem. I usually only use SRS though when I'm streaming. I mean, we have it for in-game comms and immersion, but normally we're just in Discord. You know, if we're playing, we're in Discord. If I'm streaming, I'm just in SRS. Because Discord can get really hairy during a stream. It could turn into madness pretty quick. Devolve into madness! Alright, there's our turnaround. Easy breezy. That's a lot of rubber on the road, man. It does make it easy to figure out where to land on the runway, though. Aim there. I'm on the wrong side, but oh well, fuck it. I'm taking off the wrong the wrong way. <laughs> That's okay. 
All right. Flaps down. Now let's go through it. Flaps down, gears locked. Yes. Okay. That's good, that's good, that's good, that's good. Okay. All surfaces are working. Brake on, spool up. And wait for it. And release. Here we go. And basically we wait for 250. 250? Ah, something like that. I usually take off around 250. That's probably not right, but... It works for me. Just keep her nice and gentle on the runway. 250, pull back slightly. Try not to tail strike it. Come on. 300, she should start lifting. There she goes. Hold it, and we're up. Gear up. Gear's coming up. Flaps up. She's going to try to sink a little bit. Or she's probably going to try to sink a lot. Okay, flaps back down. She's arguing with me. All right, now we're climbing. Angle 10. All right, now let's take the flaps up. Wizard 1-1, one, one. Chevy 9-1, request bogey dope. Chevy 9-1, Wizard 1-1, one, one. clean. Okay, if you want to bring in... Uh, if you want to bring in, like, uh, enemy aircraft, you have to go to comms, use F-10 other, and then scramble air to air. And then once you scramble air to air, you go back in and tell it to scramble again under the F-10 menu, and it'll launch aircraft for you to shoot down. So, yeah. So basically it'd be comms, other, and then F2 random scramble, or you can choose what to scramble, or you can intercept bombers, or you can escort bombers, all that stuff. God, really guys? Okay, talk at the same time, why don't you? So yeah, a lot of stuff there uh, to hit, which is really cool. Um, me, I'm gonna hit some... Me, I'm just going to track down the SAM sites that are already here. Pull that back to 70. Close comes. F10 map. What do we got? Let's see what's around us here. Uh, I lost my mouse pointer. Where's my mouse pointer? Windows out of focus. There we go. There I am. I need to go south. South? Southwest. Okay. Oh, that's fine. No problem. I'll be here, man. All right, so if he scrambled bad guys, I'm going to have to watch myself. Because it's going to get really interesting. I'm still heading north. Oh, I am. Um. 
Okay, 3130, gotcha. No bad guys, I'm slick. Oh, okay. That's cool. Just get the feel for her, huh? Makes sense. F10 map, where are we at? Now let's get the tool out here. Here we go. And it's going to be... What are we at? 21.8 for 74 miles. 21.8 for 74. Right? 21.8 for 74. Actually, 23.3. All right, 23.3. I can kind of tell where that's at. All right. Let's turn everything on. Go. I can never read meters. It's like, okay, I'm doing 500. I'm going really fast. And I'm probably really not. I'm probably like doing, what, 200 knots or something like that? It's really strange to me. I probably need to be doing something like 700 normally. Oh, here we go. Is that speed gauge? I think that is. It is. Okay. So blue. Ugh. I basically want it above blue. Gotcha. So 600. I want it above 600. Which is just about everything this plane's got in it. Jesus, the gas is just going to go away. Gas? What's gas? We don't need no stinking gas. It's crazy, I put this at 100% fuel, I'm just watching it go away, it's like, wow. It says it's got 300 range, but it sure doesn't feel like it. I'm just watching it go gulp, 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 gulp. Uh-oh. I'm heading to the right, okay.
I like the fact that it is a little faster than an A10, but I feel like, I don't know, it doesn't have the lift of an A10, you know what I mean? Not really. God, that is gorgeous. And the sound mod just brings it out. It really does. It just... You guys probably didn't notice the difference, but... Man, I sure in the hell noticed the difference. the other side of that mountain. You know they have new shaders for VR? It's uh, another DCS mod that doesn't affect um, what is it? The uh, multiplayer checks? I'm thinking about getting it. It's supposed to really clean things up and uh, increase frame rates. And it'll work until Vulcan comes out. Of course, they've been talking about getting Vulcan for this for, like, years. You know? And, and really, Vulcan will help the VR users. Anybody that's got lower-end hardware. Really won't make a difference for anybody else too much. Yeah, we'll just bump above this little rock here. Zoom! Keep going straight ahead. Looks like. Oh yeah, I'm getting there. It's on the other side of these mountains. We'll find our SAM sites there. We'll hit them and then try to RTB back. Refill, rearm, do it again. We got six missiles to burn. And I, considering they're pinging the hell out of me, I think they're going to shoot at me. So this could get interesting. Frame it up a little bit. Trim, trim, trim. And these mountains are like 15,000 feet, I think. Some of them are 18,000. So, I mean, even though that's like, oh, 600, it's radar ranging. So it's like how far from the ground I am. Yes, 2.5. We won't nearly need as much gas to go back. Range, 248 it says. Thank you. 
There we go. I see things. Okay. Bring it around. Forty. Oh boy, there's a whole bunch of fun shit. Okay, we'll start with the 40. And lock it. Alright, we're locked. Oh yeah, there's SA-2s. Alright, I could probably hit those with the other missiles without a problem. Lost the 40. You got launch authority on that. Seriously? No way. No laser ranging. Okay, never mind. Long way to go, basically. They're watching me, though. What's going on, dude? Uh, rough today. Oh my god. Never mind. There is no access. Yeah, I know. There we go, planes trimmed out good. Oh, I just got back with the Oh cool dude. Did you guys have fun over there? I'm hopping in there. Awesome. Yeah, Jug Bug's flying around here somewhere too. He's at a F fifteen learning how to fly. Having a good time with it. Oh, just lost all my contacts. Uh, computer's keeping that one, though. But no, I've crashed more times than I can count today. Uh, we uh, got the camera working, but then we had VR issues. Blew a USB hub. Uh, let's see, what else has gone wrong today? Started to stream off with no sound. Um, yeah, you know, the normal, <laughs> the normal weekend shenanigans of things. I was going to do Elite Dangerous today, but I couldn't log into the server. Uh, then found out the Comcast killed my firewall, so nobody could log into the server, which really made me irritated. I was like, man, what is up with this? It just kind of went on and on and on, you know? Alright. I got the 40 back. Oh, here they go. Okay. Uh, I do not have launch authority in any way, shape, or form. Field check. Almost 2,000. Okay. Well, that's interesting. And my throttle just went out. Cute. There we go. Quick way to get it fixed. Don't work close. Gonna be running on vapor by the time I get there. Gee whiz, man. Seriously, dragging hard with all these, all this ordnance. Should have taken a fuel tank.
Right, she's struggling hard to keep up. Unless I've got the throttle opened up all the way. Heavy plane! Heavy, heavy. Eighty percent power and see what happens. Besides I falling like a brick. I know anybody right say the air brakes were open. Well they're not. Yeah, when they're empty, but you know. Uh, any base you want, basically. Just, you know, blue side. Really. I mean, you could do red side, but, you know. We're all sitting here on blue. Yeah, I'm not carrying any fuel pods, though. Those are all missiles, man. Every one of those is a missile. And that thing is heavy as balls. Well, you'll either be the one everybody kills or you'll be killing everybody. Or we just won't shoot. You know, one or the other. It doesn't really matter. I'm not exactly into a PvP mindset. I'm sinking like a brick again. Okay. Don't know how to go weapons hot. Ah. Well, if you're using... It depends on the plane you're using, honestly. If you're using the free plane, like I am right now, I, you just set air to ground and, or air to air and do your thing. Um, if you're using, like, the F-18, you have to turn on what mode you want and then make sure Master Arm is on. So, yeah. Range, who the hell knows? Okay. I lost range on my target. There we go. God, I'm so heavy. Almost at 2,000. Okay, first things that are coming off are these big guys. Because, good God, they're heavy. They're heavy! Heavy, heavy! She is just seriously struggling to stay up. Poor, poor, poor plane. I'm so mean to her, right? What the hell am I going after? I wasn't going after anything in the ocean. I think I flew past what I was looking for. <laughs> I'm going after the carrier group. <laughs> yeah, okay. My targets are behind me. Right, turn him out. Right, it really is.
no. Nah. Yep, nope, wrong button. F10 other. F8. Sure. We'll call in Sam Sites. Ugh. Wow. All Sam Sites have spawned, excluding the Sam Challenge. Okay. EOS failure. EOS failure. What? EOS failure. 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 Yeah, yeah. EOS failure. EOS failure. That's good. EOS failure. Hey, I broke something. EOS failure. EOS failure. EOS failure. EOS failure. Something in me? EOS failure. 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 I don't see any damage. EOS failure. 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 EOS. Shush. There's nothing wrong, you weirdo. Yeah, EOS failure, all right. You. Psychopath. All right, let's climb. That was random. EOS failure. What do you mean EOS failure? No, no, EOS failure. But I'm not on, I'm not, I mean, nothing's broke. EOS failure. But nothing's damaged EOS failure. Okay. It's an electronics failure. I know, but the electronics are fine. That's why I was just like, the hell? Was totally random. Yeah, laser ranging and everything else is good. What the hell? Uh huh. Done out. Almost in range. Something apparently went, but I don't know why. We weren't shot or anything. It's just random, random failure. I don't know. It is a frog foot. That's all I can say. All right, we're under two thousand. I gotta start working my way back home or it's gonna be bad. Which I am, thank God. Right, got launch authority. And there we go. Missile away. Nope, they got a lock on me now. Alright, let's get down. Please tell me that's not out friendly. It really shouldn't be. <laughs> oh, he launched. He launched. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. He fired back. Oh, he's fired too. Crap. 
Oh boy, here we go. I don't know if I hit him or not. Missiles uh, lost track. I don't know if my missile hit or not. I hope so. Ah, crud. Come on. Block. Firing. Hope I'm not too close to the ground. Nope, there it is. Missile's out. And she's tracking. And I've got no missile launches. This is a very mysterious alarm, right? Got her! Alright. I'll shut her up for a minute. Set another missiles. Got a smoke plume. Oh yeah, she's down. Fire and wreckage. That's what I want to see. Thank you. Doodle. Oh, now that I'm doing well, you want me to pet you. I see how. I see how you are. I want love now. Oh, that was a good hit. Looks like I hit the, uh, oh yeah, I did hit the, the triple A too. Nice. All right. Hi, doodles. Love you too. All right, bring it around. Oops, wrong button. F1, please. Stuff behind me. i oh, pretty girl. Yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna make it back to the airbase. Got a pretty high signal going on here. I'm not seeing anything though. There's the F-15. Chug bugs over there. I'm a chug bug. Okay. Should be getting on it here pretty soon. I mean, it's threat range anyway. Unless it's the two I already nailed. That's possible. I got some more Sams coming up down the line, though. Oh, yeah, she flies much easier without those two gigantic missiles on there. She's actually hold she's actually trying to go up. All right, there we go. Much better. Less than 2000 pounds though. Range 1 2 Oh ha ha. That's funny, Chuggy. <laughs> I see you back there. <laughs> Beep. Yeah, if he was, if he was a bad guy, I'd be dead as shit. <laughs> That's hilarious. I see him. I see him. Boop.
I'd be toast if there was an F-15 on me. I'd be no way in hell I'd survive. It would be over... It'd all be over but the crying. At that point. I love it when both they were actually like, hey, this is what I'm doing. At the same time, it's like, really, guys? Okay. These mountains are steep. I wasn't looking at my instruments. I think I was flying flat, but I'm not like 20 degrees up, you know? It's like crazy. Okay, F-10. Yeah, still heading on target. It's just taking forever to get there. Oh god, I'm almost down to a thousand pounds. I don't know if there's any air bait behind. Oh. This is Katasi. I could go land at Katasi. Which is on this side of the mountain range, which is good. Because I don't think I'm going to make it back. Definitely did a one way trip. Alright, there's my Sam's. Back over the mountain. Yay! I think. Several contacts again. Oh. I don't know if the, you know, those are the ones I'm looking for, though. No, they should be that way. Assist with air-to-air -air cover. Nah, there's no air-to-air -to, -air to worry about, man. We're on the training server. Unless you spawn air-to-air, -air, there is no air-to-air. -air. Arco 1-1. One, one. On station at Moles 269 for 70 at 6,000. This is weird that I'm not getting picked up. Halo jumped in an SC-33. Nice. Oh, hello. Mm, still not seeing any radar contacts. Odd. It's bizarre. Mm. Okay. What's that in here? 
63, 10 miles. Okay, 63, 10 miles. Gotcha. Changing heading to six. Basically six five. Here we go. So somewhere over here. Yeah, I got nothing. Except for a really low gas tank. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything. The map lies! The map lies. Alright, let's bring it around. I need fuel. I guess Katasi Air Base. I suppose. Katasi? I think that's what's around here. I don't know. Could be wrong. Could be Kubaletti. Let's find out. Someplace I can get gas, right? I am here. Uh, due south is a place. Range is 17 miles. It's actually where Chug is at right now. All right, due south. What is that? 180? 180. Okay, yep, I can see it actually. Well, I'm jettisoning everything. Screw that. And jettison again. Because I need to lose the weight. Somebody's up there calling trailing like a crazy person. 20 bucks is Halo. <laughs> Will you make it home? Will he run out of gas and die? Who knows? Find out on the next Dragon Ball Z. Wait, what? Let's see, navigation. There we go.
Oh, Mr. Airbase! Please be around here. I'm out of gas. Yeah, it's around here somewhere. Uh, should be on my left somewhere. Code one one, Katasi, clear to taxi to runway seven. Katasi, okay. Enough gas for a flyby, see if it's opened. I'm trying to figure out how to get airborne again, no problem. Alright, in that case, I'm gonna use the runway and get on the ground before I I eat the ground. I'll use the far runway. Because I think there's two runways on this. Or is that a taxiway? No, that's a taxiway. Okay, never mind. I see you. I got eyes on you, Halo. That's you. Okay. So we're going to take it down nice and easy, and I'm going to park in one of those spots right there. The ones I'm staring at. The ones that look like kind of like sand bunkers. And we'll refuel, rearm, and take back off. Oh my god, I didn't destroy a plane? What? I probably still will. I'm way off any sort of form of glide slope whatsoever. But I got enough gas to do this, so that's not a problem. Let's get some altitude. There we go. 22 up. We'll go by the river and we'll bring her in. I'll try not to bring in too much speed, though. Excellent. Clear for landing, he says. Awesome. All right, let's slow her down. Line up. I wish this thing had a flight vector. It doesn't, though. All right. Good enough. Come on. Turn dirty. Oh, she wants to stall. Okay. All righty. Flaps down. Go. You're down. Get her to the yellow mark. Let's get that runway lined up. Right now, this is a really terrible lineup. There we go. Nice and easy. All right. 
do some more power, bleed more speed. Looking good. Six meters a second. Oh, that was sweet. All right, killing power, pulling back on stick, use that as an air brake. Some friction going on. Get off the side of the runway, get out of everybody's way. That's probably the best landing I've ever pulled off. That was pretty darn good. Alright, looking for a taxiway. See, he's there, so I'm gonna go left. That might be Bugman. Oh, that's an F-15. That's Bugman. There he goes. Wow, that was... Pretty damn good. As far as landing, that's my. Seriously, that's the best landing I've ever made in my life in this game. I mean, I was just like, boop, buttery smooth, you know? I mean, started to glide in a little load and was like, add a little power. And she just, <laughs> That was awesome. I'm sorry, I'm really proud of that landing. That made me super happy. It's like I said, I I never I never make landings like that. That was totally awesome. One off, or engine two off, engine one off. Let those spin down. That was Argo awesome. one one on station at bullseye two seven one for eighty at six. Oh, oh, that's bad. Oh no, who was that? Oh, that was Chucky crashed. He ejected, then the plane crashed. No, Chuck Bug! Actually, it looks like he survived. He's over there, I think. Just fireball. I didn't even hear the detonation. There we go. All right, ground crew. Uh, rearm, refuel. Wow, I had 10% fuel left. That was it. I mean, actually, that's plenty, but still, it's like... Okay, these guys are heavy. Um, can I put a, no, I can only put a fuel pod there, right? Yeah, 800 liter under the wing. Ow. Odds. Hmm. 
First things first, we're gonna fix whatever the hell broke earlier, because that was odd. Alright, ground crew, F8, we're gonna request repairs. Request repair. Copy. There we go, repairs, 170 seconds. I don't know, maybe it was just a random failure. I mean, that could be it. It just went poof, you know. Could have been a random failure, I think. Somebody decided to say hello to the ants, right? Controls are jacked. That's why I need to practice. Gotcha. No, no, it makes sense. We decided to say hello to the ants. Boom. That's what the training server is for, man. Is to crash, explode, blow up, do stupid stuff. I mean, really. Nobody's serious around here. I mean, maybe you know, once in a while we'll try something serious. But if somebody fucks up, somebody fucks up. <laughs> or if the controls are screwed, the controls are screwed. I, nobody cares in this group. You know, this is like, I try to make it novice friendly for everything that we do. Like, hey, we do all this novice stuff. So if you ask any questions or you need to learn something, come here. But we also do this advanced stuff to have fun. You know, so the novices can try the more advanced stuff and have fun. And if they screw up, oh, freaking well. I mean, nobody cares. It's a game. You know what I mean? Because I'm one of the things I, and I'm not saying this about DCS community. DCS community is awesome. But I have gotten on DCS servers where they're like, you didn't properly call out that you were taken off. You didn't do this. You didn't do that right. You did this wrong. Hey, this is broken. Hey, did you know? Did you know? Did you know? Did you know? Am, am I trying to qualify for my pilot's license or am I just trying to play a game and have a good time? Okay. I'm just trying to have a good time. <laughs> so is everybody else. I mean, we'll get to that point, but not now. Oh, cat hair in my VR. Here we go. I almost ran my finger right up my nose trying to get that cat here too. <laughs> oh my man, just tickling my brain. Like I would love to try like Enigma's Cold War server. I heard that is an amazing place, but like if you don't have the skills, it can just yeah it yeah yeah <laughs> that's all i can say is just yeah yeah some people will like run you off so it's kind of like mm. so i'd like to like get my skills together to go do something like that All right, we should be about done on the repairs. I think we are. Repairs complete. Okay. Let's load back up. Yeah, repairs are finished. Okay, good. <laughs> oh, excuse me. All right. You know what? We're going to keep the same loadout since I'm so close. And I'm here instead of way the fuck over there. So let's grab some gas. Oh, God, no wonder. Look how close it was to maximum. No wonder she was complaining. He Yikes. Yeah. Mm. You know what? Uh let's remove this payload. I mean there's no air to air threats out here. Yeah, I lightened her up a little, but not really a whole hell of a lot. Okay, never mind. You know what? I just I'm just gonna keep them. In case somebody calls in fighters during their practice. I'll just get used to flying with them. That way if fighters do come in, I'm not completely defenseless. Yep. Oh. Those big boys weigh a lot. I mean, seriously. Okay, um... I need the pod. Hmm. 
No, I need those. And they're 640 apiece. Okay. Mm, not sure where to pull weight from. I mean, I could yank that one. Hell, I could yank that one and add a couple of gas pods, honestly. You know, a couple bags, but I don't need to travel that far. It surprises me, though, that it only has 4,000... Well, I don't know if it's 1,000. I don't think it's pounds, obviously. I think there's my pound weight, and it's ridiculous. Um, I'll roll with it. Request refueling. We'll just rearm. Request Copy. rearming. Why is the big flap on my back open? Because yes, and that's your air brake. <laughs> that, that's your air brake, Halo. Mm -hmm. If there's a big, big flap that goes, Whoop, that's that's an air brake, pal. It was the air brake, yeah. <laughs> and there you go. All right, fueling back up. This will take a minute. Yeah, ground crew and refuel. <laughs> do, 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 do. Things a moment. At least there was a friendly airbase out here. One of the things I like about the, the free plane, the FC3 planes, is you can actually fly them on an Xbox controller. Did it all the time. Oh, there he goes. Look at him go! So like the F-15, like what we're seeing here? Yeah. I used to fly that on an Xbox controller. It was fun. It actually did well. And then I tied it into my Otis. And that was even funner. Once I actually got one. Once I got my X-55. Back in the day. But yeah, way back in the day, I used to play DCS on just, you know, an Xbox controller. Like, uh, well... Like that. It's how simple the controls are on these things. You know, for the FC-3 planes and the free plane, you can fly it off those. The Flaming Cliff planes. And they're modeled just like the real stuff. It's just the controls, you know, obviously you can't click around the cockpit. But, you know, I mean, flying off an Xbox controller is not bad. It works. Especially if you play Xbox games, it's simple. Uh-oh. Oh, uh... Oh, I don't know what that was. It was black and smoky, whatever it was. Oh, here he comes. Uh, is that supposed to be smoking like that? What'd he do? Looks like a black comet. Uh-oh. I think he ripped something. Something fell off the plane. That's not good. <laughs> something, something, complete. something's not right there. Oh yeah, oh yeah, that's, that's, that's not good. Oh, there's the explosion. Oh god, I love the sound mod on this. <laughs> Just my hopes and dreams, don't worry. Really, Rev? It's fine, it's just my hopes and dreams. It's okay. We are complete. They went down in a blaze of glory. Alright. We are good, apparently. Funny the fuel gauge doesn't say that. Oh, electrical's off, that's right. We just got repaired. Okay. Electrical back on. Fuel's winding up. Gauges are straightening out. 
There we go. And voila. Okay, really good. Let's fire up engine one. Surface controls responding. Hydraulics are good. Engine's coming back up. I can turn the music up a little bit more, I think. If you guys want to know, this is Net Zone. I love it. It's royalty free. It's pretty cool stuff. All right, engine one is good. Engine two, starting. Engine two is started. All right. One and two are good. Close the canopy. Here we go again. Don't hit that light! Lights are murder on your tires. Very bad. Bishop 1-1, one, one. take off runway 7. Alright, we better do a rolling. Laps down, because we're going to need them. Runway 7, here we go. Roger, Springfield 1 1. Cold 1 1. Patisi, clear to taxi to runway 7. Alright, baby, come on, you need to get up there. That's what that yellow mark is, that's takeoff speed. Oof. Come on. Come on, Beastie. I know you're heavy, but you gotta go now. We gotta go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Come on. Something popped. I lost something. I don't know what it was. Something with the landing gear, I'm sure. Gear up. Damn, what did I lose? Nope. I got a fire in the engine. Damn it. Yep. Shutting the engine off. Jettison. Gotta jettison. Yep. I gotta dump everything. There we go. Cold 2 1. Searching. Clear to taxi to 
One one declaring an emergency. Mm. I seem to be on fire. Mm. Fire bad. I got one good engine. Speed is not fast enough. All right, let's get my nose down. There we go. Oh no no no! Don't you do that? Come on, nice and easy. Ah, oh, damn it! What the hell happened to the engine? It must have. Oh, I bet I sucked up something. Colt, two, one. Debris. Colt, two, one. Taxing the area. All right, coming back around. Arco, one, one. On station at Moles, two, seven, three, for 80 at 6,000. Oh, I'm about to make a mess out of this runway. All right, you're down. Oh, I am giving her everything she's got here. All right, I need nav. Nav. Nav mode, there we go. All right, descent is good. Good descent. Definitely gonna, oh God, man, she's like, wee! This, this, this is gonna be fun. Okay, I got it. I'm good. Let's bring it back some more because I'm coming in way too fast. Oh, this is going to be ugly as shit. Maybe, maybe. Come on. All right, I'm on the ground. No, you can stop doing that now. Nope, come down. Hi, right, bug. This is gonna get ugly. I'm going in the grass. I'm going in the grass. Coming through. Okay, okay, we got it. We got No, we don't. No, we don't. No, we don't. No, 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 I'm on the ground. Shut it down. That was crazy! Wow! Oh, that was nuts! What the hell happened? Look at that, the whole back just blew right the hell out. Just boom. Dodge 2 is RTB at 260. She just exploded? Hey, we got it on the ground though, and it survived. That's a win, right? I mean, they can always tow the airframe away. <laughs> Sounds like a damn lawnmower. Hey, actually, it might be an electrical problem here. Yeah, she really did pop a blood vessel trying to take off. I am surprised I got it on the ground. I really thought I was going to wreck it all over the runway. That was pretty cool. That was pretty cool. I had fun with that. Where were we? Katasi? Kataki? Something. 
Then again, that could just be the sound screwing up. There we are, Kataski. Uh, you know what? What do we got here? We've got an F-16. Block 50. That's cool. A-10s. we got some F-14As. We do have an F-14B here. Ooh. I'll do that. <laughs> Sounds like a blender. <laughs> God, that was great, though. Just boom. Right? And she still had a conniption fit, but yeah, whatever. Okay. But now, honestly, that plane's not bad. You know what I mean? She's a good plane. All right, we are hot and started. So let's uh, get some armament here. Because I don't know what we're carrying, if anything. Refill, rearm. Not a damn thing. Okay. So, um, yeah. Bums. Uh, let's see. 82s? No, 393s. Or 73s. Yeah, there we go. Let's do Bombcat. Bombcat! Planes. pounds. See, this is why I like the Tomcat. How do you overload a Tomcat? You don't. <laughs> you can't. This thing is just annoyingly cool in the fact that you can't really overload the fucking thing. You can get close. You can get real close. See, look at that. Super close. Oh, you actually can't overload her now. Ugh. Must be the new Sparrows. Used to be you couldn't do that. Yeah, she's slightly overloaded. Little overloaded. About like 20. Okay. Heard that explosion. Just a slight explosion. 99% fuel fixes the problem. Okay. There you go. Uh, let's see. Jolly Roger. Why not? Request rearming. That's a sound barrier break. Nice. <laughs> yeah. 
<clears throat> Don't smoke, kids. It's bad for you. God. So I just keep on smoking. <laughs> Guess we're done rearming. Looks like it. All right, we're ready to rock and roll. I love that. Oh. Yeah, not today. That's right. Hopefully the Tomcat doesn't blow a blood vessel. Jeez, I can't believe that 25 just boom! Uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh! She did not like that. Hello? I'm playing in the mirror again. Sorry, I couldn't know myself. Every time I get in the time cat, I gotta play in the mirror. Why did you buy the time cat? I can play with the mirrors. I can look at my pretty helmet. It's so pretty. All right, so we're gonna hold short of the runway, pull the wings out, and then, uh, yeah. And then light our hair on fire. Is this freaking thing? <laughs> hey, we're going up, goodbye. All right, the time cache is nuts for that. Oh, I gotta rework the air brake on this one yet. That's right. Just gonna put air brake here and disconnect there. I should do that. All right, hold short. Here we go. Parking brake on so I don't roll away. Why I set my controls? Here we go. Let's see. Air brake. Air brake. Brake, 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 brake. Uh oh. Let's try it this way. Break. Speed. There we go. <clears throat> right. Excuse me. All right. Clear. And clear. Okay. And then go to joystick. Extend. That'd be that. Yep. We'll change that. And retract. Go. That takes care of that. And then autopilot. We want one of the. What was it? Disconnect? Off? Whatever? Yeah. Autopilot off. Joystick. And I want that right there. Autopilot, emergency disconnect paddle. Well, gee, look at that, Bob. It's already set. Cool. That's groovy. Hmm. 
What would I set this to then? That should be the... Oh, that is the toggle. Okay. Right. And then... Okay. Cool. Almost stabilization back on now. All right. <clears throat> Set. Looks good. Groovy. All right. Work and break off. Let's go. No traffic coming in. We're going to rev up and launch is what we're going to do. And I hope she'll stay stable. I hope. She likes to turn. Okay. Set, set, ready. Oh. Flaps. There we go. All right. Here we go. That took no time at all. <sighs> all right, all gears and flaps are clear. Okay, Neil, two o'clock, three o'clock. Hmm. There's Chug. Steering doesn't want to work. Not sure if it needs to be enabled. Uh, you, most planes know wheel steering does need to be enabled. There's usually a button for that. Sometimes it's just labeled as NWS. Follow the coastline if I can figure out where the coastline's at. Uh, coastline is that way. Okay, here we go. Let's find the coast and then we'll head north. We're gonna climb up 30,000. God, look at her climb. This thing is such a monster. I think the only thing it did out climb is the F 15.
That's because both these planes use the same engine. It's just F-14's heavier. Well, the F-14B is heavier. Correct. Yep, that's right. Once you got it enabled, your rudder becomes your steering. Magic one one on station at Molesview seven five for ninety at fourteen. So I've got some dirt at nine o'clock. Dirt. Oh, I guess we do. PT. Hmm. All right. Interesting. Copy that. On guard. Cool. BD. No idea. Fifteen thousand still climbing. Make it more of a gentle climb here to save the gas. <clears throat> Ready to climb 1.5 and 20,000 feet. Groovy, man. There's the coast. Basically want to follow it up. I'm sorry, I can never get over this. I mean, this is the Caucasus map, and it is still gorgeous as hell. And when VR is running right, man, it just doesn't get much better. I mean, Microsoft, Microsoft Flight Simulator, you know, but it's a flight simulator. It's not a combat sim. But I bet you that's still like super relaxing, you know? Should be coming up on target soon. Switch to. Go. You're in a ground mode. And loading tape. Okay. Do you can you believe this thing had like a tape drive in it? That's how the computer ran was a tape drive. It's crazy. I mean, the plane was developed in 1970, you know, so I get it, but even like in the 90s, it still ran off a tape drive. It's like, guys, upgrade to like a solid state. <laughs> they existed back then, you know, or just just a, a, a hard drive or something. No, tape drives. 
wild. <clears throat> of course, Legacy Hornet used tape drives too. You know, for its uh, bitching Betty stuff. Yeah, that annoying voice that says, pull up, pull up! Yep. Tape drive. Crazy. It's crazy when you think about it. I mean, I understand why they retired the airframe and the plane. There was so much politics behind the F-14. But the reality is, the damn plane was as old as I am. You know? I think it's actually a little older than me. Not by much, but I think it is. I did the look. I think development started in the late 60s. But I know it was deployed before I was born, so. Yeah, that's true. Well, that was one of the things. There was a lot of politics, like the original A, A model, the F-14, Grumman wanted to use a different engine, and the politics behind it, they were basically, government was like, no, you're using this, so like, guys, this is a bomber engine. It goes fast. If a fighter pilot's got to roll the uh, engine back and forth, it's going to have a compressor stall. And they're like, we don't care. It's like, okay. Sure thing. <laughs> you know. So they had to, like, roll with it until the Department of the Navy was like, hey, this thing has compressor stalls. <laughs> and then Grumman was like, well, duh. It's like, we wanted to use this. This is what they put in the F-15. Oh. Okay. And then we, yeah, they upgraded to the B model politics. You know, it's like, come on. Alright, Master Arm on. Should be coming up on it soon. It was all politics. Everything, everything about the plane was politics. Politics, 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 you know? It was crazy. I've drifted down to 17,000. Oops. Sam warning. No Sam lunch, but I got a Sam warning. Apparently it's ahead of me. Excuse me. It's probably one of the best planes, I think. Houston, we have a problem. I've commandeered a plane with no ammo. Whoops. Well, you know you're not supposed to do that, right? Mm -hmm. I'm just saying. There, I think that's my target. It's a runway, anyway. Uh, oop, yep, that's her. Yeah, let's start bringing it down. We're gonna go straight across the runway. A lot of targets down there, but we're gonna hit the runway. That's what we want. We want to put the runway out of commission. All right, rudder. Here we go. Do speed, air brake, slow her down. That way when I pull up, I don't snap the damn wings off again or depart. Yeah, departure's bad. Come on, I'm not landing. Speed's still 400, which is good. All right, turn her in. Uh, it's looking pretty. It's looking pretty. Oh, it's right on the line. It's lined up pretty good. Come on, give me the X, give me the X, give me the X, give me the X, 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 X. Come on, come on, come on. That's my pull-up cue. X, X, there you are. 
Oh, bombs away! Look at that! Oh my god! Oh, goodbye. I'm not gonna run away right the hell out. Oh, we are super slow. Like, stupid slow. That was good hits, man. Right on the runway. Of course, it won't stay because it's a training server, but still. Ba Boom! Not bad. I really gotta get those guys running properly, though. I don't know. I upgraded the map and nobody shoots back anymore. And they just gotta stand there and look at you. You know? It's like, uh. Can I help you? If I stall, Goose dies. That was stall, Maverick! Mm -hmm. That was super insane. get low and fast to get the hell out of here. In all honesty, they'd probably be launching something at me right now. I'm afraid to scramble uh, anything, though. 12 o'clock. Oh, it's a 15. Okay. That's Chug Bug. Chug Bug! Let's get low, fast, and dirty. Yes, I know. Run that out a little bit. There we go. Beautiful. It decided to ram you instead? Wait, bogey? What? Mm. Oh, did you call an error? I haven't seen anything. Oh boy. Jester hasn't made any call outs yet. Alright, gas is getting empty. Tanks are drop tanks are empty. Bye bye. Ooh, now she's really light. Jesus. <laughs> Technically I have a kill now. Nice. SA2 missiles. We're gonna launch. Oh, I see.
I think we're back in friendly territory. Basically. Well, we got dirt at 3 o'clock. Dirt at 3 o'clock? I got dirt everywhere, buddy. There's dirt all over the place. What are you talking about? Dirt. No, I can't. There's dirt. Thank God, that dirt. For the love of dirt. Twenty-four thousand. We're Joker Fuel. Basically, get off the burner, stupid. Got it. No, I think. Isn't that my air base right there? Well, there's the lake, so probably. Uh, no, it's farther up the coast. Never mind. Let's check. Where am I? There's Bug. No, that's Jinkery. It's up ahead. Just keep going forward. Bug is way up here with me. I guess he saw me climbing and climbing and he's like, oh, okay. Zoom. Okay, we got dirt at 2 o'clock. And uh, nails, 4 o'clock. And oh, a spike, 4 o'clock. <clears throat> Funny spike, I think. Roger that. Okay. There is a friendly eagle, five o'clock, three miles. There's a runway. Ours is going down. No, oh, no, no good. Somebody's on fire over there. Oh, that's not good. That's very bad. There's something not friendly over there, shooting the crap out of everybody. I'm gonna have to find it, I guess. All right. <clears throat> Let's get on the ground first, though. Speed, way too fast. Need to be slower. A lot slower. A lot slower. That's not what I want. That's what I want. Okay, that's better. You're down. idle. This is going to be a little close. We're lined up good, though. Alright. We're at landing speed. Our nose is up. 
It's like we're gonna just like bark it, man. Man, the CO will bust our balls for that. Again. <laughs> me, 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 me. You complain too much. You're way too fast. I got it. Well, this is not the way I wanted it. There we go. <laughs> Watch out for my carcass. Right? I don't know what runway this is. It's a tiny runway. That's what it is. Really tiny. I don't know. Uh-oh. I don't know where I landed. Oopsie! Do you know where you're at? No. No idea. Man, this plane has no weight on it. I meant idle as she's trying to, like, speed up. It's like, good lord. But she weighs nothing right now, so... Yeah. It's like I gotta see her just lay on the brake. <laughs> Northeast of the corrected landing area. I'm northeast of my desired airstrip. Oh, yeah, this is like a, uh, huh. It definitely doesn't look like it's designed to handle big planes like what I am. Oops. It probably will still handle it just fine. It's Parker over here. Just for a second. No master caution, which means I didn't bring anything. That's good. Let's bring the flaps up. I don't want them getting stuck because I have a tendency to break. Go. Okay. I'm gonna shut this horse down. Kill the engines. generators yep and we're dead up the canopy you might talk to the ground crew because <laughs> you know without generators you don't have a radio so uh, yeah, as the crew chief yells at me, what the hell do you think you're doing? Um, yeah, can you like I don't know, put me back together? <laughs> Not available. Now that's available here. Okay. What about uh bombs? Not available. Huh? Drop tanks? Not available. Basically, nothing's available. 
Not available. What about gas? Can you give me gas? Oh boy. What do we got? Two sidewinders? Yeah. Okay, remove. 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 Uh, remove. And remove. There. That's what I got. Request refueling. Request rearming. No response. Okay. Maybe I can get gas here. Maybe. Hard to say. I don't think they can help at all, actually. Oh, shit. That's a bummer. How embarrassing is that? Good run. Hit the airstrip. Blow up some stuff. Make a mad dash back to the, you know, across the line. Thinking, oh, I'll turn around and land here. Yeah, thank you at the right airport. And it's like, wow, why is this runway so small? Probably because it's not designed for Air Force use or Navy use or any military use whatsoever. Oops. And I can't even fuel up the plane. What do I got left? 5,000? 5, 5,100. Yeah, okay. Center up. Disconnect ground air supply. I don't even know if they'll do that. Nope. I don't think we have a way to get off the ground since I shut everything down. Nope. We don't. We're stuck here. We're stuck here forever! Oh, that's okay. Select rolls. I still got it to the ground. That makes me happy. That was pretty good. All right, let's pull the F-16 out. <laughs> Next chunk bug, I think. I don't know who that is. It could be Halo. And an Israeli F-15. Hmm. All right. Let's see how we're armed. If we're armed. We are not armed with anything. Nope, we are clean as hell. Alright, let's get some Mavericks on this bad boy. Go shoot some ground stuff. See, which one do I want to take? I don't know. Mm, infrared? CCDs? I'm not sure. I'll take the Ds. The one parked in the odd places. Me. All right, let's move my air brake on this plane now too. Uh, let's see. Just controls. Speedy brake. 
Refueling complete. Speed. Helps if I spell speed correctly. No. Okay. Uh, break. Uh, break. <clears throat> Wheel break. Anti-skid. Huh. Alright. Error. Area refueling source knob. Bank. Labels. Pitch. Ladder. Camera. Jump. Defense. Mm. Why aren't you just debating? Rearming complete. I can figure out what it is, though. Do that. SP break. Okay. 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 Forward retract. What? Wait. Extend. That's weird. Okay. I mean, yeah, I get it. Okay. So that's my extend, right? Yeah. Paddle switch depress. All right, so I need to change my paddle switch. All right. Here we go. That's what I want. And then retract. There we go. I can pull these off for something else, which is cool. Now, paddle. Put that there. There we go. Groovy. Should work. Obviously, it's not working as intended, though. Huh. Well, extended them just fine. That's weird. another button.
wonder why I won't use that button. That's so weird. It works fine for all the other planes. Why is this one going to be a pain? Okay, so this is the one plane it won't work on. How flippin' bizarre. Works real fine on the, all the other planes. But this one's gotta be a pain in the ass. <clears throat> Go figure. That is really weird. I'm totally lost on why that doesn't work. It works for the F-14, it works for all the other planes, but the F-16 is like, derp. It doesn't want to use the paddle like that. Ah. Ah. Yeah, okay. That's weird. Okay, so I have to put it somewhere else on this plane. Nuts. Okay, I guess I'll put it back where it was. I mean, whatever. If it really wants to be that way, I suppose that's fine. I just don't get why it's an issue. It's like, it's odd. Yeah, you sit there and look at it and go, I don't get it. <laughs> Which I don't. I don't understand, but okay. Sure, whatever. So you want it back here, right? Okay. Cool, I guess. It just wants to be difficult. Hmm. No. Well. There. Fixed. Let's check it, make sure it is working. Yeah, and that's the way it should work here. Because this is the switch that comes back. I, I just, I, but I don't even know. You know what? It doesn't matter.
It's just one of those moments where you sit there and go, sure, yeah, okay. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like my parking brake. It doesn't work either, apparently. Are you serious? Ow. Hey, you're just all sorts of trouble today, aren't you, Mr. F-16? Okay, well, that's fine. Whatever. Let's go hunt some things down. I don't know, I'm going to have to investigate why that doesn't work. Seriously. Who is on my leg? Tiny? No. We're not doing this. If you start to claw, attack my foot, or anything, I will drop a two-liter bottle of soda on you. And you won't like it. <laughs> nah, I'm kidding. They're fine, Snap. Just don't do that right now. I'm apparently missing a stick. Hmm. There we go. Yeah, see if it even shows the paddle switch there. It... Very confused right now. Who's confused? I am! Okay, great. Alright, home display is up. Yeah, it's weird. I could read this, but on the Apache, it just throws me. Of course, you guys already know that. I mean, just look at last night. Ugh. God, that was horrible. Counter measures are go. All that looks good too. Nobody's landing. All right. Went friendly up there, but that's okay. All right, Bishop one one taking off on way south. I'm just gonna roll her out. She's drifted. She loves the drift. Can't believe he uses sixty thousand pounds of fuel an hour at that, you know, speed. It's like we just burned a quarter of the drop tank we just put on here.
Alright, master arm on. Laser arms. And we should have some targets if we just follow the river. Usually do. Anyway. Unless they've already been obliterated. Air to ground mode, go. Okay. Mavericks. Yep, that's what I'd like to see. Ah. Sorry, my MFDs are unplugged. I have to do it with the mouse. Yeah, it's fine. All right, power on. Take a few minutes to warm up. Well, once they are ready to go, they should come back. They should come up pretty good. Okay, till then we'll look for our targets. Except usually right down this way. Altitude 3000, sounds good. We're going to hold altitude here. And heading roll. No, oops, wrong one. Sorry. Sorry, airplane. There we go. That's the wrong one. All right, then we're running. Hey there, Halo. And Chuck Bug. Nice. Well, there's our ground targets. See, this is why I like it when there's people on the server. It's kind of like you're just flying around, people doing stuff. It's great! Like Chuck, he is trying to. Jesus Christ. You know what? I think that was every bullet he had. Oh, I think they're shooting back at him. Oh, God. Oh, that didn't look good. Red unknown infantry with an AK. Oh, my God. Okay. Nice. Something is shooting back. Maybe it just takes a while for the AI to wake the hell up. Oh, something went boom. Something went boom. All right, you guys powered up yet? Or are you still working on it? I think it's still working on it. Should be about ready to go. Visual, please. Thank you. remember how to see what the Maverick sees. Been a while. 
Yeah, swap it. There you are, weapon. Alright, thank you. Alright, let's bring it back around here. Sensor slides. Uh, where did I put that? Wait, where did that go? I, I forget which one that is. Is it that one? That one. That one? That one. None of those. Okay, great. Uh, yeah. that is exactly. No. No. Yes. Ah, down. Okay, thank you. Alright, let's find those targets. I was like, why the hell can't I find this? Because you're hitting the wrong things, man. Should be right over here around the river. Somewhere. Looking, looking, looking for targets. Should be right around here somewhere. I might be going the wrong way down the river, too. That's extremely possible. Come on.
No, they're around here somewhere. Come on, we were just watching Halo and Chugbug blow the crap out of them. I know they didn't kill them all. Gotta be around here somewhere. It is not like I god damn it. Well, it's been a while since I fly in the F-14, so I'm not really or 16, so I'm not really surprised. Oh, what am I doing wrong? Ah! Ah! Gotcha. Well, why the hell did it... You know what? Never mind. Don't want to know. Just roll with it. Come on, baby. Oh, you're being bitchy as hell now. Not tracking. <sighs> I hate it when I do something wrong and I don't know what it is. It makes me crazy. Huh? Oh, what is this? Where's my missile looking? You gotta be kidding me. <sighs> I really do not know what this missile is doing. Besides so looking in all the wrong places. Is it looking upside down? What the hell? Okay, no, front of the plane. I'm looking at myself. Really? Thank you. You psycho missile? Good God. I'll just look over there. It's fine.
Yeah, no idea what the hell it's doing. It's just doing. Like, okay, sure. Crazy lunatic. There we go. Altitude. That's Altitude. better. Got him. All right. So whatever its malfunction was, it got over it. <laughs> AKA, I learned how to shoot. How to ammo, bingo fuel. Got that, Halo. On the other hand, I got gas for days. Ah, come on. Not locking. Altitude. Itchy thing. It's like it just doesn't want to see it. I don't know. Grumpy Gus, that's for sure. Altitude. Altitude. There we go. A boom. Nice one. No dice. Some sort of bombing practice range, apparently. I am not very good with Mavericks. But I will get better. That's something. What the hell? Altitude. Altitude. Where are you looking, psycho?
pull up, pull up. I mean, honestly, this is a standoff weapon. I shouldn't be using it like that. Oh! Sorry, infantry! <laughs> that should be like, you know, 7,000 feet in the air going zoop. I'm getting in way too close. in here. There we go. Uh, right about there. No. There is something there. Altitude. Altitude. Can't seem to find what I'm looking for. Oh, gray out. There we go. Testy, testy, testy. Altitude. Altitude. Come on. Anybody got any suggestions to make my uh, Maverick usage easier? I'd probably have to go over some WAG videos. Because it seems a lot easier on the A-10. Seems to just be struggling here. I just won't lock. Pull up. Pull nope. up. Damn it. Pull up. Got one left and it's acting squirrely as hell. I'm the problem, I'm just not sure how. Alright, one more time. Almost. Come on. Lock onto it, would you? 
No, no go. Damn. The last missile's just being a pain in the ass. Okay. Well, that's interesting. Oh no, Chugbug killed an eight today. Poor Chugbug. <laughs> Chugbug splashed the runway. There's bits of Chug all over the runway now! Good God! There we go, got it. Finally. Missile away. Jesus. I think I was asking for a miracle. Mm. Alright, Matt, last Maverick out. Let's see if it actually hits its target. Good God. Looks good. Great and steady. Oh, goodbye. Mr. Two to go boom. Nice. I clearly need to get VR, yes. Oh dude, VR is great. I I can't. Hmm. I can't say enough. And with graphic card prices going down, yeah. Thank God graphic card prices are going down. I saw a 3090 Ti for the same price that I bought a uh, 3070 six months ago. I was just like, wow. I mean, they are going down. Going down quick. Now, hopefully they keep going down, to be honest with you. All right, so that was the last missile. Now let's see if we can get the plane down here. All right, gear down. I'm not coming in all that fast. Definitely not aligned though, that's for sure. There we go. Man, look at me hitting the landings today. And that's when I crash. Oh, hush, it was a joke, stupid plane. 
I'm gonna start that crap. That was a little rough. Just a hair rough. Hmm, gotta be close. Yep, yeah, it's gonna be close. I still did it though. Gotta get back on the E. Okay. And we're back on the E. There we go. Nose wheel steering on. Wasn't the greatest landing, but hey. I'm alive, right? And somehow I didn't damage the plane. him soon. Actually, according to J2 Sense, it's probably not coming out until, what do you say, June of next year, it looks like, is when they're pushing the 4000 series for NVIDIA. So, yeah, if you want to get yourself a 30 series, now would be the time to do it. Nice, dude. Alright, so this is it for me for tonight's stream, though. I am on stream. Toast! Can't stream no more because I'm going to start making some really bad mistakes. But guys, server is up and running. Everybody who's on open beta, everybody who's on stable can join the server. Play around, have fun, learn some things, do some training, stuff like that. I'm going to be hopping over to the Discord uh, if you want to, you know, come over with us. So I'm still going to be on, but I'm done streaming for now. It was a fun night. So many technical issues! And we got to resolve them. Can't beat that. So I'm really kind of shocked. You know, it's like, wow, we actually, uh... Was actually able to resolve every one of them. That never happens. We got the camera back, too. I'm a happy guy. Now, the question is, will the camera work tomorrow? Mm, hard to say. We'll have to see what happens, but, uh... Guys, I wanted to thank you for hanging out with us tonight. Please don't hesitate to join us. We don't bite around here. We just have a good time. And uh, I'll catch you guys on the flip side. You have a good one. Stay safe out there. And remember, as always, it's always a conspiracy. Every time. I don't care what they say. It always is. Every time. It's a conspiracy. Always. Send foil. Ah. All right. See ya. Bye. just happened. I didn't press any buttons. I just shut the light off and it's like, oh yeah, by the way, talking. Okay, whatever. Anyways, have a good night.